the designer. Each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their account, and the runner-up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com or you can post your photos to Jewelry Maker Studio, Ivy House, Henley Road, Studley, B80, 7DU and make sure you don't forget your customer number. Get making and good luck. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join a community of over 65,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions, send photos of your designs and enter our Wall of Fame competition. Or if you need any help or advice, you can email our friendly help team. Make sure to get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. You can now book Jewelry Maker workshops online. Just head over to our Jewelry Maker website and click on the workshop link. We have a wide range of workshops from beginner to intermediate, covering a variety of mediums. Once you've found a workshop you would like to attend, simply click on the book now button, fill in the required fields, and then press continue. This will take you through to the payment page. If you have any questions, you can contact our workshop coordinator at any time by emailing workshop at jewelrymaker.com. We look forward to seeing you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Jewelry Maker and thank you for joining us today if you've just tuned in. My name is Rebecca Redekin, but you can call me Becky and it is my pleasure this evening to be joined by the oh so glitz and glam so. Katie. Hello. Oh my gosh you look so sparkly I'm obsessed with it. This year this time of year is about sparkle right? Yeah any excuse bit of sparkle. True that. Yeah. I'm loving it. And you know what? You've got sparkle in your jewellery too, haven't you? I have, I have. Tell us a little bit about these kits. Because you're, uh, you're giving loads of kits. Loads of kits. Mm. Loads, loads of gemstones as well. It's so lovely to get, to get beautiful gemstones. And we've got that spark with all them facets on, on the gemstones. We've got amethyst, spinel. I can't get more sparkly than spinel, can you? No, you're right. Absolutely gorgeous. That is just divine, isn't it? seven o'clock kits these ones yes genuinely we've got two alternate colorways essentially for all intents and purpose so it's not one of those where i'm saying you've got loads of kits and therefore you have to buy like four different elements to get one full kit it is essentially you can get the amethyst selection or you can get the one with the quartz and the spinel so you get two totally different looks um but really beautiful effective because yeah. of the shape and obviously how you've put them yeah, together as absolutely well. fantastic it's really well put together mm -hmm. and we've got two two wire gauges we've got the the one mil and the, the 0.6 mm. and even though we haven't got that very fine weaving wire we can still take it so so much further and use it for head pins and mm. you finding it's fantastic mm. It's just divine, isn't it? Really is absolutely beautiful. Let me also let you know I've got dainty and delicate because these will go perfectly with my uh, retail quartz that I've got oh, coming yeah. up straight away. Eight p.m. I have got for you your beautiful rose quartz. Danny, do you think we could go under a tenner on that strand? <laughs> now nah, you're gonna go 14.95 we're not it's gonna be under a tenner and i don't mean by a five but okay should we get started with some retail let's do it this is this sorry is a part of a previous deal of the day um so you may well have spotted it on your screens a couple of times before 
when it's a deal of the day, it generally means we get a really, really, really big um, amount of these strands. And then we essentially bring them to you um, at a great deal. We are going to mimic this great deal for you today. We have got for you under a tenner, shouldn't be, by the way, this is just mimicking the deal of the day price, which technically we don't have to do, but because of the minimal amount we've got left, we fancied it. Eight pounds and 95 pence for you on that one today. Gonna go great with um, some very sparkly high-end gems, for example. <gasps> wow. A very special parcel, a very expressive parcel on its way for you at six. 45. I just love that. Glamorous, isn't it? £8.95 on your four mil. Do not forget, we love hearing from you. So if you do fancy text us in, do feel free to. I was asking you before um, what, uh, if you've got anything lined up for Telebox over Christmas. I've got Gavin and Stacey. Yeah, I've got Gavin and Stacey circled, and I've also got Wurzel Gummidge circled. Oh, I didn't know that one. Oh, yeah. Brand new Wurzel Gummidge oh, you need to tell me on when. Boxing yeah. Day. Yeah, I'll let you know. Yeah. I'll give you... Kerry has no idea <gasps> what Wurzel Gummidge oh, is. I love Wurzel Gummidge. Dan, yeah. do you? Yeah, I've known it. You do? Yeah. What about you, Danny? Never heard of it in his life. <gasps> it's essentially about a scarecrow that comes to life. Yeah. And Aunt Sally. Oh, Aunt yeah. Sally. Oh, brilliant show. Anyway, let us know what you've circled. Also, Casey and Danny came up with a rather good text in. What was that? Yes, last minute Christmas disaster gifts, successful gifts at the last minute, anything that was like <gasps> last minute. Down to that. the wire. Yeah. Did it work? Did it not work? Yeah. I love that. Yeah. Down to the wire, Christmas Eve, driving past the garage, that kind of yeah. last minute. Okay, yeah. I love it. I want to know your last minute disasters for Christmas or your last minute success stories. Uh, 20 carats worth of these. It's a three mil now. I will show you it alongside the four mil. Give you an idea of size differentiation. I love this strand for its sparkle, for its oh, glitz, for its glamour. So sparkly. Three mil is so unusual for us to see. We generally yeah. like to stick to the evens. We love a two, yeah. a four, a six, and eight. Yeah. What is, because I always think four mil and three mil doesn't sound like a big difference. No, it six and doesn't, by the way. But if you're going to incorporate it? it into things like seed beading as such, if you pop a four mil in, yeah, it's very similar to a size six, maybe seed bead, mm -hmm. but your three mil's actually a lot better. It's going to fit in a lot better. I, I, that's it. That's my opinion, definitely. Mm. Especially if, if you're going to be using it for, for them sort of designs where you want to fit that seed bead size in. But also if you just want a really gentle graduation yeah. from your four to your three, just for a really nice bracelet. So it's yeah. just finished off and it gives it, even though you can't really see it a lot, but yeah. it just gives it that really professional Little. finish. Yeah. Mm. I just think it's beautiful. And if I show you it as well with the two mil, I just want to show you all three. I will be bringing you the two mil next. Four mil, three mil, two mil. But let me just show you how nicely they can work together. Yeah. Isn't that just next level? Yeah. Don't you think? Can you imagine those just, I would even just go randomly thread onto your memory wire. Oh, lovely. And have maybe, maybe three coils of memory wire. That would look amazing, wouldn't it? And really just randomly pick. Yeah, just randomely pick them. Absolutely gorgeous. Mm. Maybe a few of them rose quartz scattered in exactly there as well. Exactly what I was going to yeah. say. Yes. That's taken it somewhere else now. Yes. That's lifted it a little bit more, hasn't it? Let's see if I just sort of interject that. Yeah. That oh, is this gorgeous. is making Danny think of a oh. New Year's party. Yes. Look at that. Look at that. Daddy said he didn't have his outfit planned, but now he's seen this oh. bracelet, all of a sudden his outfit is complete. <laughs> Wear some socks, your toes will get yeah. cold. <laughs> <laughs> Two wheels are now on screen. One of the most difficult shapes and sizes, sorry, to cut, obviously, because we still need to get all those lovely facets on, but we've got much um, smaller area to do it on, which means essentially more room to mess up. With these ones though, as you can see, the caliber of the facet is sensational. It worked great with my eight o'clock oh. deal. 
See, to me, these 95. should be more expensive because it must have taken so much more skill, yeah. so much more skill. And to, just the, it's just mind boggling how mm. they actually drill, uh, you know, drill a, a drill hole through the centre of that. It's so mm. tiny. Yeah, you're right. It's amazing. And it's one of those things that obviously you do the facets and then you do the, the drill hole. But imagine, and this must happen more often than you might think, You've done the facets, it's taken you ages, you've done it perfectly, and then you yeah. go and drill it and it's gone on the wonk or oh, it's shattered yeah. or whatever. You know, you've got it's one to be of them, so precise it? with that size, haven't you? Yeah. Amazing, amazing. And don't get me wrong, you might think, yeah, but, you know, they managed to do it on seed beads, but that isn't quite the same thing, no, you know? No, no, yeah. no, no. Jilly Sue, what's it in? Saying, good evening, Becky, Katie, and crew. Should we say hello to the crew? Bonjour, Dan. Hello. Good, <laughs> nice. Yeah, good. There's Dan. We've got lovely Danny in with us tonight. Hi, Danny. There he is. Bonjour. We have got the lovely Kerry in with us this eve. Hiya, Kerry. There she is. We've also got Chris in. Hi, Chris. Right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Just hello would have done, yeah. but nope. <laughs> Uh, we have got that lovely crew in today. Christmas disaster last year was all three Wattsits had full on flu. Christmas day was two hours up then asleep. Oh, oh my goodness. Wattsits. Poor little, poorly Wattsits. That's, yeah, that's, that's a poor. tricky. Yeah. Hope it's a lot better this year. Yeah. It's got to be, hasn't it? Yeah, it would be it would be rude to have that happen two years in yeah, a row. Yeah, yeah, you can't. Nah, this year all completely, completely hyper. <laughs> Christmas Day cooking disasters. That's a good text in. Have you ever? Um, I once forgot the gravy. That was the yeah. Uh, that that oh, wasn't good. Dan has taken yeah. that really seriously. That, yeah, I took it. I. I was, Mortified. Yeah. Mortified. Let's face it. Yeah. Gravy is, is a big staple, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. It was a while ago. It's not happened since. No, yeah. no, no. You only no. get burnt once. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Well done, everyone, on those. Let me bring to you a scoop. Oh, that I brought this is where you. you. Get all those different sizes and shapes. These are Ooh. fab, aren't they? Ah! Oh, I love how unique these are. Lava kite, don't get to see it often. I quite like the fact that with this, you have the opportunity to get loads and loads and loads of different shapes and sizes. But also, if you've not seen lava kite before, it's basically a labradorite in the fact that it has a lovely toyancy under the surface. And it's got quite a similar color palette, hasn't it? Yes. But the fact that it, I think, is slightly more subdued. Yeah, for me, it's, it's like, like a labradorite, but it's more stormy. Yes. It just gives you that pew all of a sudden, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yes, you're yeah. right. It's just that, that literal flash yeah. of lightning. It's amazing. It is. It's really unique. And I love that you're getting quite a few sets in here, which is going to be great for your yes. creativity. So even quite unusual shapes, like these pear drops that I'm holding here for you. I've got two of those. Two pairs, so that could be my pair of earrings. I've also got one, two, three of these sort of lovely barrels, if you will. I bring into you loads of rounds in here of different varying sizes. I've also got some lovely big ovals in here. I've got almost two of your, hang on, steak. Rice bead shapes, for example. Oh, uh, yeah, they're like olives, those, aren't they? Yeah. Gorgeous. They're lovely, aren't they? Yeah. So there's loads of differentiation. When, as a guest designer, and if someone is new and they're thinking, hang on, I can't guarantee what I'm going to get, so how on earth do I get my head around it? What's your tip for working with like a bead Ooh, scoop like this? My tip is pop, put them all out in front of you mm -hmm. and let's just get some, get some beading thread, thread them on to get, see what works, what works together, get out there, even if you've not got much of a stash already, definitely go for sort of your greys, your blacks, your whites, definitely mm. your monochromes and things that are going to work really well with this. Mm. Yeah, just have a play and see what works, see see how things fit against the wrist and think, you know, some, maybe sort of these larger ones wouldn't be so so good in a bracelet. Very but true. But if you put them on the neckline, mm. it's totally, it's a, it totally change, changes, mm. it, changes it up. Mm. So definitely this is kind of one that's going to fit in with the rest of your stash really, really well, especially mm. with this, this colour tone that we've got. And trust me, Lavakai is magical. When, when you see it in the flesh, it's beautiful. It gives you extra, doesn't yeah. it? 
$8.95 is a drop down deal. It should be $11.95. But for you today, we're giving you that extra sweet treat. And it's lovely to be able to get a bee to keep at such an affordable yeah. price. Yeah. Because and that carrot weight is huge. Absolutely huge. Minimum 500 yeah. carrots. How many pieces of jewellery would you guess oh, is gosh. in here? Lots and lots. I mean, especially if you're mixing it with the rest, rest of your stash. But even if you were just to stick to this, I think you'd probably get, you know, up to maybe between seven and ten pieces of jewellery, depending wow. if you're using bits, pieces of chain and things as well, definitely. Mm. So, you know, a pound 25 yeah. max per yeah. item. <laughs> it's kind of incredible, that, isn't it? That really is astonishing. I just love that shine that you're getting underneath the surface. It's divine, isn't it? And actually, if I show you it with... Oh, that works well with the, that pink. Thank you. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, that looks good. They work, don't they? Yeah. This is coming up for you, eight o'clock. Um, say that again, pop it. Ooh. Don't forget, I've got these coming up for you as we start by in a moment or seven. But for now, Oh, that's gorgeous. For all of you that love those sunset hues. Oh, that's so rich, isn't it? Stunning, isn't it? Gorgeous. Bringing to you now your Hessenite Garnet. Hessenite Garnet has got this wonderful abundance of, of quite an autumnal, almost cinnamon, warming, crackling log fires hue about it, hasn't it? I think it makes you think very much of this time of year. It makes you think of those kind of, you know, cosy nights in, maybe a few drinks in your local pub with your friends. It's that kind of beautiful colour palette that you've got here that I think is so enticing. Let us remember that this is one of the rarest colors of gems. If you want a color of a gemstone to have this almost um, citrus hue, then more often than not, you might opt for a mandarin garnet. It's one of the most expensive garnets on the planet. This is almost a little bit more, I would say, achievable in its look. Um, maybe a little bit less rambunctious than that of a mandarin, but also much, much, much more affordable than the likes of your mandarin garnet. 30 carats worth. It is natural. I mean, come on. Let's just enjoy that for one moment. Twenty one ninety five. Yeah. How many times yeah. have you seen Hessenite Garnet? Not very often. I could probably count on one hand this yeah. year. Definitely. Definitely. It's absolutely got so rich, so decadent. Absolutely gorgeous. I think that is an incredible opportunity for you. Let me just show you. Let me just show. I have literally got one strand. Okay, one strand. This is what we've got on our website. One strand. Nine pounds and ninety-five wow. pence for you today. Oh, that wow. I that is an absolute seize the moment opportunity. It really, really, truly is. You've got to dive in on this. You've got to grab this opportunity. Yeah, that is by miles the most affordable, isn't oh, it? Oh gosh, yeah, definitely. And all the uh, just thinking of my top's kind of like a coppery bronze. That's going to go beautiful with it, yes. isn't it? I just love the warmth of it. I mean, imagine it with just some pearls, just absolutely, it just really warm up those pearls beautifully. Mm -hmm. I just yeah. love, I'm looking at this and you're so right. That kind of, if you've got any rose gold or sequin, yeah, yeah. anything that's got that warmth, it's, it's just going to complement it it's beautifully. But again, like I said, with pearls, even if you would just put white pearls with it, it's going to give them that beautiful warmth. Mm. Yeah. Hello, lovely ladies and fab crew. Hi, crew. Hello. Lovely. Um, my Christmas disaster. I left the turkey out to defrost. Sounds all right. Christmas Eve, woke in the morning and the three dogs and cat had eaten it, Mandy. Oh my goodness. Oh no. You can't even nip out and no. grab one. Can you? Not, not, not on Christmas day. What did you do? What did you do? What I, I don't understand. Oh my goodness. Oh Mandy, I feel for you. You'd that be is... having all your veg and maybe some fish fingers or something like that. Oh, well. yeah, yeah, <laughs> nice. I mean, it's, yeah. it's unusual. Yeah. My sister's from Liz. Hi, Liz, in lovely Kent. My sister moved into a new house just before Christmas. She didn't realise her oven didn't work until Christmas Day. No roast veg and 
fried turkey. Oh. Sorry, are we frying a whole we... turkey? Yeah. You know what I mean? Are we are we cutting? Are we deep fried? Yeah, for yeah, yeah. But okay. who's got a deep fat fry that big for a turkey? Surely it's slicing it off. Like in a slow cooker? No, because that's not fried, is it? No, no, no. Even then, how big's your slow cooker? Oh, I've got quite a big one. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I know. Fucking... <laughs> uh, well done, everyone, on that absolute bargain you've got your hands on there. Let's dive in. Speaking of rose gold. Oh, oh have a so look. Pretty. What do these make you think of? <gasps> oh, these are like springtime Easter, isn't it? Oh, they're so gorgeous. Aren't they? So sparkly. These have got delicate little cubic zirconia inlaid within there. That is divine. That is an incredible amount of sparkle and shine. You've got that beauty and that... You've got that beautiful, rich appearance. And I love that it juxtaposes with it so much because you get that beautiful cubic zirconia, that diamond-like ice white quality that really reflects that wonderful rose gold colour. It's divine, isn't it? We have got for you 925 solid sterling silver and we have got for you all three pairs. That's mega, that, isn't it? There you go. Let me flip that one around so you can see them at different angles. There you go. We have got for you all three pairs today with the butterfly backs. Just to let you know that the butterfly backs state 95 on them, just there. So if you do give these to someone, they will know you're giving them top-notch quality. The lovely thing with these is actually you could get away with a bit of work, just snip this section off here, you could get away with that being a stud earring. But obviously, with that aperture at the base there, you could add chain to this. You could add maybe any more butterfly motifs, because I know we've had quite a few this year as it has been a trend. You could add more butterfly uh, motifs to this. You could add birthstones to this. And as I mentioned before, please let me remind you, if you do want to get premium delivery today, it is likely that it will be with you in time for Christmas, but I cannot guarantee it. I can't guarantee it. So if you're thinking, oh my goodness, last minute gifts on really quick makes, this is the type of thing you want. Although yes. I'll be honest, I cannot guarantee that you will get it before Christmas. I definitely can't if you get standard delivery and it's it's a bit of a chance to really with the premium delivery. So I just thought I would let you know that now because this could be as simple as grab a head pin yes. and a stone. Oh, yeah. Yeah, very, very simple. Simple wrapped loop straight on. But like you say, I wouldn't even bother taking that loop off if I was to wear them, them as a stud. I don't think you're really going to notice that. No. I'd definitely wear, wear them as a stud. Maybe make some make some attachments that could go on with a, an open loop so you can actually just interchangeable. Ah, that's yeah. a good idea. And like you said about chain, that would be nice uh, if you had like an ear cuff up the ear and then chain from... From the bottom of the, the butterfly up to an ear cuff. That that's would be nice. such a nice idea. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. a really lovely idea. How about you make an ear cuff? Uh, with wire. Yeah. With wire, you just, um, you just form the shape. Yeah. Don't forget, actually, speaking of shape forming, we've got that mandrel tonight. Oh, yeah. But uh, they're making your bracelets and your bangles, yeah. etc. So that is on its way for you. Now, nine to five, solid steel and silver. Three pairs, one price. Such brilliant. a good deal. Absolutely brilliant. Such a brilliant deal. Because genuinely, now I've, uh, I, you know, don't have my nose piercing or anything, but knowing what I know of a nose stud, it's essentially yeah. a bar that turns over, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. A little bit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, but yeah, could you, do you think, create a nose stud with this? I don't see any reason why not. You would just yeah, have to make that nice. slight bend in it just yeah, to, bend to stop like... it from, from coming out. Bend it over yeah, with the pliers, maybe. And it's maybe. not too big that it would be uh, hmm. overpowering. Because they're not big at all, are they? It's only delicate. It's only little, little delicate. Yeah. Um, £7.95 for you today. The reason I'm bringing that up is because... When I was in a well-known shop, a supermarket that Jamie Oliver used to hang around in. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. The one who used to uh, like to dance in the moonlight, if you remember. Um, but yeah, they have a stand in their sort of 
clothing um, um, part of the store and it says sterling silver jewellery starts at £7 and there was one piece of jewellery that was sterling silver and was £7 and it was a nose stud. It was one little ball detail nose stud. So if I were to break these down as nose studs, yeah. I've got six of them, seven ninety five. you know. And butterfly bats, which are always useful. Do you love amethyst? If you do, there's some coin up in the kit that you're going to adore, but I'm also going to bring you an amethyst now, but this is very, very different. Oh, I love these. I love the shade of these. Absolutely gorgeous. Isn't that divine? Light amethyst. Almost a rose de France. Yeah. Almost a delicate sort of rose de France here. You've got that beautiful nuance of almost pinky peach. Yes. I think that makes it slightly different for those of us who are February babies, as I am. A lot of the times a February baby, when I'm gifted my birthstone, I'm gifted the really, really dark, deep colour, which I do love. This is a little bit of a, a tilt on that, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's a little twist on it, isn't it? Yeah. What would you do with a strand like this? I, I've had this strand before myself, and I've just literally hung one from a chain in an earring just maybe about an inch of chain just one one from the bottom mm. it's quite a state statement look but beautiful i mean just i mean just in a bracelet if you want a really statement chunky bracelet a holiday bracelet something like that and just separate it maybe with uh, some of the agate from the kit or something like that yeah mm, lovely Gorgeous. idea got so much that would work with this today actually yeah keep it almost sort of don't know it's, it's almost Ethereal, actually, yes. I think, with that yeah, strand, isn't delicate, it? Yeah. yeah. Also, speaking of delicate, yeah, don't forget eight o'clock. Spark between each. Because although these are really big stones, you don't have to have a huge gargantuan spacer, do no, you? No. And because they're both quartz, they're at the same point on the Mohs scale, so you know they're happy to be. Yeah. So they're going to be. They're going to be friends. Mm, they're going to be yeah, pals. They're going to be pals. We have got for you 580 carats worth, and today, good deal. That's a good deal. That's a lot of amethyst. Oh, no, you don't. Okay, better than half price, about to come in. You all ready for this? Do, do, do. Wow. 9,095. How many do you get on that? That's, that? that's yeah. One mind. I'm much. just going to count it. Yeah. Right, let's have a count. Two, four, six, eight. 12, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, necklace really um last week we had the um we made the expandable ones we had the uh, the board that makes them just a, a really easy single wire necklace yeah. yeah and these are good for that because they are so strikingly bold yes they can hold their own yeah oh yeah definitely definitely show you great size drill hole as well so that's useful isn't it yeah Definitely. Great for bag charms as well, because you've got that, that durable quartz. It's mm. fantastic. It, it'll take mm. sort of being hung on the side of the bag, maybe getting bumped around a little bit. Mm. It's not going to get damaged. It's gorgeous. Yeah, stunning. £9.95. By the way, <gasps> that colour is amazing. I'm on holiday. Oh, oh you know what I mean? Together. I maybe just put one on the on in the center and then just have the rest of the necklace yeah yeah is it just me is it just me or have i got some frozen hues do you know what i mean like yeah, that's the first thing i thought Do you want up on a snowman but now i'm going aruba Ooh, you know what i mean yeah. it's different seasons isn't it i'm thinking frozen i'm thinking frozen lake and then i'm thinking Curacao, holiday, yeah. Bahamas, Caribbean. I just love it. I just love it. We have got for you that coming up in a little bit. £9.95 on this one now though. And don't forget, if you like amethyst, you're totally in the right place for that first kit. Um, this is such a unique strand. Oh, 
Oh, I've seen this on screen, but I've not seen it in, in kind of real life. That's amazing. It's cool, isn't it? <gasps> so basically what we've done is we've applied coating to this. So it gives you this really unique sheen on the surface and color should I say on the surface. The sheen, the tutoyancy underneath is absolutely real and you can see it. And this is a great example of what I always say. When we coat these gemstones, it is a coating, it is not a paint. So it's not like popping an emulsion on so you can't see anything underneath. And I think this proves it perfectly. Oh, wow. <sighs> Seeing them now in real life. Oh, they're amazing. What do you think? I'm, I'm, I'm going to have to get these. They're amazing. It's lovely, isn't it? I would just have one, just have one as a pendant. Okay. Really simple. I just wanted to show it off because it's absolutely stunning. Mm. Maybe one of the smaller ones in a ring, cocktail ring. Oh, gorgeous yeah. idea. Interesting question though. Again, for anyone who is new, and I'm aware that at this time of year, lots of new people do tune in because, um, you know, people are off work and also, um, you know, people are introduced to new things around this time of year. If you were to make this in a ring, obviously it's a top drill gemstone. So how yeah. can I secure something like this I, as a ring? I probably wouldn't use the drill hole. I would um, kind of tension set it by wrapping around in opposite directions and then kind of turning that over at the back maybe. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, just making a really simple uh, ring shank out of uh, one mil wire and mm -hmm. then just really securing it with the, just the tension of the wire. I see. Yeah. So ignoring that drill hole if you wanted yeah. to do I mean, that. If, if you wanted to, you could anchor it maybe at the top with the drill hole just for a little bit of extra security, mm. just for your own peace of mind. But no, and you're not going to see the wire going through that because you, it's not a, a transparent gemstone. No. We are bringing to you 65 carats. Mm. Um, Good price. I'm all right with that. Yeah. I'm okay I with that. If I put those all together, I would be tempted just to do that. No. We're going to go one better. One pound? Nah. One note. Yeah. Four pounds 95 for you today on this one. Now, they're so unique. I've not seen anything quite like these no, out there on the no, high street. these are amazing. Two, four, six, seven. Yeah. Got seven. That is just brilliant, isn't it? That we've got that brightness and that yeah, boldness. Yeah, and the, the, color, the coating that they've used, the, the colour tones are absolutely so complementary to, to the... Um, the nature of the stone as well it's absolutely yeah. amazing yeah it's brilliant isn't it yeah you have got 14.95 hi lena hi becky just tuned in love the 12 days of christmas bt it was so funny i love fed up bruce what you mean this guy <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's brilliant isn't it isn't he just hilarious i put um like a little uh, video of, of him sort of rehearsing um, on my uh, Rebecca Reddickham Facebook, uh, Rebecca Reddickham presenter page. And uh, I think it's really cool because obviously we know Bruce yeah. and we know how behind the scenes he's quite flamboyant, he's quite over the top, he's quite dramatic, he's quite, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that's the right word, maybe, but he's very, very funny. He's, he's very funny. mischievous. Very funny. He is. Yeah. So, uh, yes, he's, uh, yeah, it's funny, isn't it? And I know what you're thinking. Where do we find the money to hire that professional choir? I know. I know. I think it's quite obvious to say that we didn't. Um, who was it? It was uh, Chloe, Sam Wilson. It was, um, who else was it? Um... Charlotte Church, no, 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 she didn't turn up at the last minute. Um, yeah, no, there was loads of people, yeah. Um, any hoops, well done, one and all. Let's, oh, let's bring some beautiful earrings. Oh, these, these are just, these are the sort of earrings I would just bob in every day. Exactly. Yeah. And what I love about these two is they are a stud, but they've got a, a hidden little depth yeah. to them. So if I just wanted to, wear them like this as a stud earring, then I absolutely can. They are going to sit slightly below the earlobe, but they almost look like a big statement yeah. stud. But actually, they've got that hidden little loop at the back. So for anyone who is new, why is that a handy little addition? It gives addition? you the option to add something. So it can be just totally worn on its own. Absolutely beautiful, just, just on its own. But to being able to add something, to be able to personalise it, maybe add a birthstone or mm -hmm. something, with just a very simple 
simple wrap loop or just a simple loop so it's inter interchangeable mm. just makes them so versatile yeah really it does they are 95 solid sterling silver round earrings a massive gram and a half in each ear so that, that is sturdy yes, isn't it yes you, you know that's know gonna last yeah yeah glamorous and I love with these too, they are large enough that if you did want to get two pairs, bending this section up, creating that loop and making it into yeah. a pendant and having, you know, the earrings, maybe a charm. Yeah. And then one's a pendant. Yeah. Oh, definitely. It's done. We have got 95, one and a half grams worth in here. Your price points. For that wow. gram weight, it's incredible. And let yeah. me just say it, 9.95, let me just remind us of this. It has fluctuated recently, but a few months ago, we were saying if you are paying six pound per gram, you're getting a good deal. Not sensational, but you're not being taken for a ride. We're saying if you go, you know, if you go into any shop and you're offered, say, a chain and you're working it out that it's about six quid a gram, you're getting a good deal. Actually, at that price point, We've taken that and thrown it away, yeah. haven't we? We are looking... How much is that per gram about? I should work that out dead easily. It's about three pounds, yeah. isn't it? Yes, that guy, Bruce! <laughs> love him, lol. But wish he would smile more, lol. <laughs> this guy? <laughs> oh, he's so brilliant. Oh. He's fabulous, isn't he? He is brilliant. And uh, we, for the 12 treats of Christmas, Lena, you will be happy to know that he will be out on air a few times during that mid-show. So, uh, so to look out for. So to look out for. Uh, well done, every single one of you. Okay, Poker Lee. I'm moving on. And I'm good for you. Oh, a bead scoop strand. I love a bead scoop strand. Oh, look, I was I was spying this earlier. It's amazing, isn't it? What is it that caught your eye first off? It's just it's it's when I see something that's multiple, like you can see sort of how much sort of how far it will go. Mm. So if you break it up, but I do love just using it all together. But I love actually just kind of cutting these. I try and keep them in line mm. so I've got that graduation mm. and then just looking at them so we can actually see like the kind of face of each one as well. Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. I love like, just identifying. It's just a fun strand to have, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is, isn't it? And you get to see all of the personality. That one there has got like a uh, zebra jasper like look to it. I did add zebra jasper barrels in the previous hour. You've got uh, quartz in here. You've got things that look like lapis lazuli. Yeah. You've got... Um, what else have we got in here? Citrines, I've got rose quartzes, and speaking of which, da da da, spacing them out. Yes. Just keeping them random, but spacing them yeah, out. Yeah, and having something that's quite small to space them out. Because if you put too much of a gap between them, it's, it's gonna look a bit odd, you need that balance. So definitely having something that's kind of this size to space them out, mm. just so that you get to see a lot, lot more of the gemstone is amazing. One hour and 31 minutes, seven seconds, approx, until I bring you that strand. I've got just shy of 200 of that. Sounds like a lot. Wait for it. Woo. Anyway, there's loads and loads and loads of treasures coming up for you today. One of them is, of course, this wonderful bead scoop strand. Different colours. Big, bold look. Big, bold graduation. Only thing that's not big and bold about it the price we're rolling down for you today 18 quid great price for this especially as you pop a little chain on the back and you're basically done 7.95 i'm no mathematician but that's a tenner back in your pocket right yeah that's a tenner back in your pocket way better than half price deal on that one 7.95 that's brilliant isn't it i think it's is this road or something Ah, is yeah, yeah, red crow's head looks just like it. Yeah, like Labradorite I've got. Onyx. Appetites. I've got up here. <gasps> Look at that lapis. Look at the pyrite in that. Mm. That's amazing. That is brilliant. That is such a lovely strand. And, you know, obviously, there's the idea of making one big piece. Let's say I wanted to make five pieces of jewellery. Oh, what could I do with this strand? Easily. I would section them off into... Um, I'd, I'd, cut one end and then pull the uh, the thread out and then I'd section them off and kind of graduate 
lots of different sections. So you've got that graduation on each, and I would just make maybe five necklaces and just have chain, just have that little section there. Yeah. But because you don't have to use it in this graduation, you can make your own little graduation. Mm. So so you've got sort of matching necklace, but nothing will be identical. No. So each one's new, unique, gorgeous. Mm. Um, um, tell me the truth, if I'm being a bit peculiar here. Could I take off, like, all of the colours and ombre them in colour, ignoring the size, or is that going to look absolutely disgusting? Because your face is saying the latter. <laughs> I'm your saying face no. is like, what? No, thank I'm you. I'm saying no, but I was saying you could try it because I wouldn't want to re regraduate. Got you. Yeah. Yeah. Got you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You go ahead. You go ahead. Go ahead. Go. Let me know. Yeah. Get back to me. But don't ask me to regraduate. <laughs> 95 on this strand for you today not long until the absolute decadence that is the beautiful garnet comes up it's beautiful wow, isn't it that's amazing all the purples in there it's astonishing that's, isn't it the quality is amazing isn't mm. it absolutely beautiful someone's asking me what time the bracelet mandals mandal mandrels on 20 past seven Prox 20 past seven on that one. Um, and we will be doing demos with it as well, just so you know. I've just had a thought. I would oh. go back on what I said and I would pop them into little sections of maybe seven each. Right. Odd sizes. Yeah. And then rosary link and that would be fine. Right. Yeah. Basically, you've taken my idea. Yeah. And, right, fine. No, 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 it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think that could yeah, look quite I did, I don't think all together different, but, but the uh, rose relinking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. Well done all on that. That's very popular. Do not forget Russian Amazonite coming up soon. Let me bring you some beryl now, though. Oh. Lots of the cooler spectrum of the colour palette on this one. So let's remember when we're thinking of the colour wheel, the colour wheel is so, so useful to us as artists, as creatives. When we think about the colour wheel, more as often than not, you'll think about the hotter side of the colour wheel. So your bright yellows, your oranges, your reds, and then you'll think about the cooler side, so the greens and the, the blues. Um, general rule, although this isn't 100% set, a general rule is, a hot colour is something that will have to have red within it if you were to make it out of paint, okay? If that makes sense. So if you wanted to make orange, for example, you're obviously going to need red and yellow if you're going to be making red, and obviously it's the solid colour of red. But those are generally seen as your hotter colours. What I'm bringing to you here is the aspect of colour that has more of the delicate blues in. Blues mixed with yellows, mixed with greens. It's all going on in this strand. This is gorgeous. Delicate. Delicate, delicate. It reminds me of kind of, um, well, and it, it's aquamarine, isn't it? It's them sea colours, them beautiful, like, a bit like the sea, the colours that we see in sea glass. Yes. That sort of thing. And that's so on trend at the moment. Yeah, really it yeah. is. We are bringing to you 90 full carats worth here. And you've got that wonderful sort of individual nuances of colour that run throughout the strand. I really appreciate also actually on this, as I'm looking closer, it's got a variation in translucencies too, hasn't it? So that means I think, because I'm looking over here and they're very, very opaque. I've got more translucency here in almost these heliodor hues, actually. You have got that element of sea glass about it as well, because yeah. that is the kind of look you get with sea glass sometimes, yes. isn't it? That variation, that, that alteration. Bringing to you 90 carats worth, these are six mil in their size. 16 pounds and 95 pence. Oh. Oh, great deal. We are gonna go lower, not there. Seven pounds and 95 pence. I think that is a very, very good price for what is generally quite an expensive gemstone. Let me remind you that these are filled, so that is partly due to why the price is lower. But the great thing about the filling is that it doesn't have, um, it doesn't really affect like the color. It's more to do with the translucency that it offers to you. To be able to get it at that price is sensational. And your desert island size as well. It's so ah, so good useful. point. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Didn't think of that. Yeah. Beauty it's... feeding that, incorporating all those different colors would look amazing, wouldn't it? 
And for anyone who is new, a beady bead is? A beady bead is, it's basically a ladder stitch where we kind of get four beads and then add another three beads, another three beads, and then we roll it back on itself to create a new bead. Mm. It's a bead of beads. A bead of beads. Yeah, I could yeah. have just said that, couldn't yeah. I? No, 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 because no. you actually explained yeah. how it was done, which is always good. Love that effect. The, those agates, by the way, coming up for you later. Um, okay, now it's time to bring to you something just executive, basically. It's interesting how we here at Jewelry Maker shop for our gemstones. And we are quite an anomaly within shopping TV world anyway, um, when it comes to the way in which we purchase. A lot of places will uh, work on a basis of something referred to as um, sale or return. So for example, on a lot of TV channels, when they have a guest on, their guest will come on with a product that that guest has made, and that guest will offer the TV channel a great price. They will come, they will sell their own products, and then whatever doesn't sell on live uh, TV goes back to a lovely guest and they sell it somewhere else again, sale or return. Um, we don't have that here. Now, that is difficult for some reasons. It means if we don't sell out of something, then hey, we've, we've got to bring it to you time and time and time again, maybe even taking up space in the warehouse for something else. It also is great for you at home though, because it means that when we purchase something such as this, which is a luxury item, a luxury high-end item, the type and the quality of this parcel is the type that quite truthfully the likes of tiffany could select the types of bulgari could select the types of uh, boodles could select these are that caliber that quality but the fact of the matter is that when we go we won't do what say tiffany will do which will be i just want this size this shape this quality 30 times over we'll say give us any shape that you like but i want the top notch quality and because we're taking the ones that are maybe not the Bulgari size and shape or the Van Cleef and Arpels kind of um, facet, then we want your best price. Do better than that. Do better than that. Because we don't work on sale or return. If we are going to be buying 150 of them, they are going to be selling 150 at once. No sale or return. It's just what we've got is what we've got. Now, with all of that, you have to remember that that's a lot of work, time, effort, and energy. The fact of the matter is we don't work on sale or return. We want to sell out of these today and we're going to, this is just our buy. Get ready to feast your eyes on the pure indulgence that is this perfect parcel. It is absolutely idyllic. The parcel that we have received here is giving you an abundance of everything I have been taught to look at. The fact of the matter is that we are bringing to you that ruby, rambunctious glow in the center with that halo of very, very purple, which collides beautifully inside this gemstone to create this absolutely rich and indulgent stone. It's exemplary in its color. Let me offer you another one. So you can see exactly what I have in my parcel. As I say, I cannot guarantee you size and shape of these. Best way to pick these up, just to let you know, just for ease, is if you've got your tweezers, pop your gemstone table side down and then get your tweezers on either side. We have got for you here, beautiful cut and beautiful cut is helping make these look so executive, yeah, isn't absolutely. it? Absolutely. Yes. Don't they're breathtaking they really are aren't yes. they now as you're looking at these i just want you to remember that these are your rose -like garnet i also want you to remember that when we're dealing with rose -like garnet we are dealing with something which is very much saleable because it is a birthstone so that already brings up a surprise also for the fact that it has got this unique 
mix of colours within there. It's not as dark as some of your garnets. It's not as wishy-washy as some of your garnets. It's absolutely up to you, but if you just type in, and do feel free to do this if you want, if you go on your uh, search engine and you just type in, and in fact, I'll prove to you that I've done this. I've literally just typed in at the top here. You can see it, road light garnet. Zoom down a bit. There you go. Road light garnet is literally all I've typed in. That's it. Road light garnet. And these are the first ones that come up. Big names, well-known names, big prices are connotated to them, and understandably so. In fact, one of these rings, which again, it's not like for like, we all know that, because these ones, uh, this is a vintage stone um, with a Fenton & Co. It's not like for like, but theirs is a beautiful cut, similar to this one, not sure on the size. They're selling it in a beautiful, high quality ring, surrounded by what looks to be maybe diamonds, um, little ones, 2,100 pounds. But this is the thing, people are prepared to pay for it yes. like garnet, aren't they? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. For me, it's, it's oh, my go-to garnet, just because you do get that color tone. It's, it's so unique, isn't really it? Really, it is. This parcel is exemplary. As I said, uh, our buying team literally got this at uh, the Hong Kong show earlier on uh, this year, and we got, um, an immaculate one-off deal. But please remember, a one-off deal is a one-off deal. That price will only stand as that price stands. You have to remember that this was bartering face-to-face. -face. We can't purchase all of our gemstones in that way. A lot of them we do, but we can't purchase all of our gemstones in that way. To get the best deal, you have to spend the money to go to Hong Kong with your team and work on a deal. This is an absolute deal that we got on these ones. This quality is mouth-wateringly good. This is everything you're taught to look for in a road like garnet, and some might even say more. Bringing to you a selection, on average, just shy of a carat per stone, but that's if you get six, because obviously you might get five, therefore they might be more than a carat. Bringing to you today, love this one too. Oh, look at that. a selection of your incredible, rich, Road like garnets. Wow, I just I still can't go over this deal. I really can't. How incredible is that at a price point? Especially when you're looking at these and you're considering just the, the quality, the name, the status, the fact that this is natural Madagascan road like garnet. The fact that these could quite easily go to any well-known high street store be sold off as individual pieces. If you saw that set into nine carat gold or even um, 18 carat gold, you'd be looking at a triple figure sum for that stone. If I'm looking at this one here and I'm bringing that to you in, that to me could be platinum standard just because I know that shape is often, well, I'm looking beside me, it's paired with a platinum beside me. Um, and the piece I'm looking at beside me, although it isn't um, the exact same, it's actually earrings, but um, we're looking at 3,700. We have got for you here at luxury we have got for you status we have got here for you a parcel of exemplary quality and you know me if i haven't mentioned the price for that long it's because it's going away 90 pounds is great for these but 29.95 is better wow. now let me remind you we here at jewelry maker have never been a, 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 a sort of receding auction site that initial price that we bring to you is because we go and get these individually independently assessed and our individual kind of, you know, price point on these at £90 is fantastic, I think. Yeah, absolutely. At £29.95, though, that's why we the only... Well, that's partly because we're live on air and also because it is a star buy deal. So because it's hit tonight, it's a star buy deal. We're getting ready for the weekend. You know, we wanted to give you the most uh, exquisite deal that we could. Hence that £29.95 now. So if you do want to seize the moment and get your hands on it, absolutely do. Katie, what would you be doing with these standards of stones? Oh, I would be having them set in, into maybe even gold. Yeah, definitely. Lovely. Yeah, it gets somebody somebody like like our Haley Kruger or something like that to do set tomorrow, these mate? beautifully. Gorgeous. Yeah, but the one thing I would be doing is uh, if anybody's got a, a January birthday, I would just buy these just as a gift, just to have an amazing collection of your own birthstone of that quality, just as a gift, just to give in that lo lovely presentation box. Mm. You know, and in the future they might choose to to have them set, or they may just choose to keep them as an heirloom because they're amazing. Yeah, they really are. Yeah, and don't forget you can get them set. 
Yeah. Also, you can use them with like um, gallery wire. And gallery stuff, wire, you? yes, of course, yeah. So this would be brilliant. Twenty nine pounds and ninety five pence. If you love that kind of color palette, I've got a genteel version. Here you go. Coming up for you. Eight o'clock. Stay for an hour away. Let me bring to you one of our favorite gemstones here at Jewelry Maker, your incredible malachite. We have got for you here this beautiful strand. And I had this on air the other day. And I was saying the other day that genuinely the malachite itself, we don't always get to see it. And when we do see it, it's varying, it varies. What I really like about this strand is the fact that all of the texture is natural, all of the beauty is natural, but also the circles of this are concentric. Yes, yes. So sometimes what will happen, if we've looked at a malachite and we haven't maybe looked perfectly exactly how that individual piece and that moment has been formed, you'll get a lovely line, which a band, which is what malachite's known for, you get a lovely band that almost stops and kind of goes a bit wonky and then sort of continues and sometimes doesn't yeah. join up at all. But you can see with these, even if I take a large section there, and I'm turning these. Yeah, the time that's been taken to choose which way these are going to be cut is amazing, yeah. isn't it? It's incredible. So that's real skill, time and care, yes. isn't it? When we talk about Malachite, we're talking about a big gemstone name for the likes of Piaget at the moment, as well as other brands who are working with this. I think it's such a unique stone, which really has come into its own of late, especially with um, you know, these being really popular hues. I've been told that I am now limited on these. Single figures wow. now. Okay, single figures now. It's one of the most intense green gemstones I think yeah, you it really get. is. absolutely amazing. You, oh, do you know what I think? I was looking for these. Um, let me show you these oh, cufflinks. Wow. I love these as a cufflink. Yes. Do you think that bar that's holding them is a solid bar, or do you think it's like a chain, or what do you think that um, is? I'm not sure. Because what we've got here is perfect pure round, set with, what's that, 18... It looks like a big chain link, doesn't carat, it? Like a large chain link. 18 carat gold. And we have got that quality, that beauty, that I think goes to show two things. Number one, rounds are perfect, and obviously the selling them is a cuff link, which yes. is generally a, uh, you know, male oriented piece of jewelry, let's say. But also the fact that they as a brand have thought that's good enough for 18 yeah, karat just, gold. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. And to sing itself. Oh, Do you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. This is a luxury stone. It's a high end stone. If we were to do cuff links with this. Even if I wanted to do it solid, uh, you know, uh, these as the sections at the top and you wanted to do like a T-bar at the back, I could do cufflinks serious amounts of time over. I mean, oh, that gosh, would be yes. one pair. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, about 25 pairs for 29 pounds and 95 so pence. So couples gifts, you could do a pair of cufflinks and a pair of earrings. Love that idea. Yeah. Great idea, I mean, so I thoughtful. Look, I've seen it so often, especially looking online at Christmas presents and things. Couples gifts are, are really on trend, having matching jewellery for... Yeah. Yeah. And that's lovely because it's a really thoughtful yeah. thing, isn't it? Yeah. It's very, very thoughtful and it's it's something that when either of them wear it, yes. they can think of yeah. you gifting yeah. that to them. I think that is a phenomenal price. I really, truly do. If you do want to grab it, you do have to do so now. Um, and the information's at the bottom of your screen as to how you get involved. Let me show you it with these ones too. They're coming up in the next hour for you. I've also got the mandrel coming up and your two kits. Yeah. Give us a clue about this first kit, please. The first kit, we're gonna be working with the mandrel, mm -hmm. which is fantastic. Uh, yeah, it, they're just really, really great. Beginners, even more advanced, advanced kits. Mm -hmm. You know, there's something for everybody in there. So yeah. tune in for creativity and more after this break.
tune into Jewelry Maker every morning at 8 a.m. for our Breakfast Club. We'll be bringing you low, low prices, last chance to buy, and end of line stock. Make sure you're watching because once the deals are gone, they're gone. Check out your Wall of Fame entries in this hour and be in with a chance to win £100 credit to your account. The Breakfast Club on Jewelry Maker. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Did you know, no matter how many times you purchase with Jewelry Maker in the same day, you'll only be charged one fee of postage and packaging. Select our standard delivery for just $3.95, or if you'd like to receive your goods sooner, upgrade to our premium option for $5.95. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. You can watch our Jewelry Maker show every day on our website by clicking the Watch and Buy Online link in the top right hand corner of our homepage. This Sunday at 3 o'clock, JM gave to me Silver chain, bundles, triple finding steals Double mystery pendant, triple cap collection Double connector bundles, silver mystery charms Triple bead deals, one fed of loose Trio mystery wires, lots of threading packs Mystery gemstones, and a parcel of luxury gems on this Friday before Christmas to go Ooh. this time next week we'll swear off all food booze will be a distant memory and about 70% cheese yeah 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 yeah, yeah. <laughs> fully yeah you have to get the elasticated waistbands on everything oh it's a good time of year um, we have got such an indulgent show today for you and um, if you are just tuning in now we've already had some brilliant treats and goodies you may well have heard me mention earlier on that we have got a lot of kits today but it's like alternate colorways and we are going to get started with one in just a few moments before that let me show you some of the treats coming up in the show one hour 13 seconds ish back today rose quartz micro fasted strand who here riddle me this who here remembers the days where micro fasted strands used to be around 32 pounds yes, and I then remember. and then we dropped the price point because we got better purchases and we took them down for a playing quartz. Lowest on air deal, they'd be about $19.95. I was going to say $21.95. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the rose quartz would yeah. be a little bit yeah. more, wouldn't it? Yeah. Actually, yeah. it was a good point. 
How's about, I promise you today, under a tenner, and I don't mean by a five pence. <gasps> I don't even mean it by a fiver. <gasps> oh, it's weird, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, what was that? How odd. Mm. It's a little pirate dog, hasn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, as well as that, I have got... Up. It just bit the strand up, it broke. I'll just show you two of these for now. <laughs> <laughs> right in the middle as well. That's so unusual. Mm -hmm. Eat and gone. There's one side, the other of it. Here's the other. Lovely. There you go. And there's a few in the middle. And there's a few in the middle as well. Isn't that weird? It's just broken in the middle. How unusual. Look at that. Ooh, lovely though. They're coming up for you this hour. Not long. Also, mandrel on its way for you in this hour. We are going to be demonstrating with this, so if you have got no clue whatsoever what this is or what it does, then don't worry. The lovely Katie is here to let you know. We want to hear from you as always this evening. I want to know what you've circled in the Radio Times to watch over Christmas. I want to know if you've had any crimbo day or uh, disasters or run up to Christmas last minute purchases that either went very, very wrong or very, very right. Um, yes, do feel free to text us in. It's 60777. Take text with the word JM Studio or you can join us at jewelrymaker.com. Little box that says uh, send a message to the studio. You can get in touch that way as well. We'd love to hear from you tonight. Let's talk kits now. Um, do you know what? I could start by talking about how beautifully unique this agate is and how it almost looks sort of aura like, like um, ethereal. It it's so ethereal. I could talk about how I've got this massive amount, a full 10 meters, not the four meters strands we've done of late, the full 10 meters of a one mil wire in silver, which I feel like is like hen's teeth at the minute in silver. Also, I could talk about how you've got the 0 0.6 and how actually one mil and 0 0.6 aren't always used together, but how they can be, and they're perfect in this kit. But I'm going to do none of those things. I just want to talk about this. These are cool, aren't they? Oh, my goodness. This strand. The beauty of this strand is divine sort of a 3D marquise you've got here, that beautiful way in which it delicately, delicately sort of tapers down. It's stunning look, isn't it? It's absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful shape, beautiful faceting. Very, very high-end looking. What do you think this high-end stone did in your jewellery? Because, you know, we can see on some of the pieces it, it's basically just, just this by itself left to yeah. sing. Well, it, it adds direction and flow with the graduation that we've got and because of the shape of it, it all added to kind of the direction, of the, especially of that, that main necklace and, you know, yeah. the way it took shape. Yeah. It all came down to that strand. That's the, that's just the, the piece I went for first and then built from that. Mm. Yeah. yeah. When you think about the likes of a rice bead or a, a marquee shape, you do think about the difficulty of cutting and that's why we don't get to see it very often. So I love that you're saying that essentially, you know, this therefore gave you a creative push because it almost directed you yeah. into the shapes and forms it wished to be placed. Yeah, absolutely. Another thing that I'm loving as I'm looking at your designs, are, for example, on that, that, man, that bangle that you've got, literally... It's so bold a piece that yeah. it stands alone. Yeah, it doesn't it doesn't need anything else. Just that one that one beautiful gemstone. Yeah. With that lovely yeah. heart. Yeah. And that's a great thing because spinel generally if you get a piece over a carrot of spinel, as a, as a general rule, that is paying attention to all of the colours, but if you get a piece that's over over a carrot, you really are getting something executive. Yeah. Generally, this isn't a gemstone that forms in, you know, vast geodes like, like uh, you know, clear quartz, for example. You know, this is something which is very selective in where it forms, how it forms, and the size in which it forms. Yes. So not only has this got that 
unique individual um, sort of shaping to draw the eye. What it's actually also got is that sizeability, which makes these much more statement than your general counterparts of spinel. These things atop top of each other makes this a really head turning strand, which is why I kind of rudely ignored the wire and the other strand just for a moment, because I genuinely believe that the price we're doing for the entire kit, and in fact, I know, you should pay more for the strand. Bringing to you today though, not only that incredible strand, which has got so much sparkle and beauty and decadence, also bringing to you the um, Chalcedony 48 carats worth. Well, I never, hang on, uh, six mil. Yeah, six mil on that one. Lovely ethereal glow on those ones, as well as all of that wire. 20 meters in total. 0.6 and a one millimeter. That is a beautiful kit that I think it's safe to say has created some really stunning jewelry. Bringing it to you today, the lady in black. That's, I will let you know, is already a discount deal. That already is a discount deal because um, one or more of these have been on sale in the last 31 days. It was on the wire, but I can't remember if it was both or not. They have been on discount sale. So actually you should have been paying an extra four pounds on top of that price. So a start price of just shy of 40 quid isn't bad on this. Considering, you know, what we're bringing to you here is a luxury high-end spinel. Today though, we're rolling down. I'm about to give you a sensational deal. That is a 44% discount from the secondary already reduced price. That's wow, incredible, that's, yeah. isn't I would it? Pay that just for that spinel. That's oh yeah, you should cuts. be paying more for the yeah, spinel. Yeah, yes, absolutely. yeah, yeah. Absolutely, that's yeah. just amazing deal. Like I say, just for that spinel, I'd be, I'd be multiplying to be quite honest. Yeah, on that. yeah. I just, mean, yeah. let's face it. Looking at this we bangle, get, yeah. how much would you buy that bangle for? I would be more than happy at a crafting yes. fair to see that for 20 quid. Oh gosh, yeah. I'm more yeah. than happy. Yeah. That's easily a 20 quid yes. bangle, but you're gonna have used one stone and a little bit of your structural yeah. wire. Yeah, you can make, and we, to make that bangle, we're only using about 30 centimeters of the one mil wire. You can make so many. So yeah. many of them. And have a little look, for example, at these lovely earrings. Look at how they catch and the I've light so beautifully. And I've even used the spacer beads from, from this strand as well, just hey, to, to add that little extra accent. Oh, and I love how they actually graduate up in size. So you go spinel, yeah. chalcedony, and then yeah. that's yeah, really cool. Yeah, just kind of pop that finish on it. So never, never throw away your little spacer beads that you go. And you these are actually everything. much larger than most, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, yeah, that's why as soon, soon as I, mm. I saw the, the strand, I admired the stone, I thought, yeah, we're going to use those spacer beads as well. Mm. I think that is just so brilliant. Well done. There's plenty of you treating yourself to this today. To get a kit under 20 quid is always special, but to be able to get this kit under 20 quid is really phenomenal. 44% discount on the already discounted deal. If you take the original RRP on this, actually, you've got pretty much a 50% um, deal there. So uh, it's well worth treating your hands to it. The mandrel is coming up for you in a moment, but I'm gonna bring you the alternate colorway now, if I may. And this is with the amethyst. Tell us a bit about this kit. Now this, the amethyst, obviously we've kind of got that, that mimicking the same shape, but it was, it was slightly chunkier as well. So it's more that olive shape with the, that beautiful faceting. And I was very, very decadent with this kit and, and what really went for it in one main piece. Yeah, and yeah. why wouldn't you? Yeah, it's, it's just, it's a delicious kit, isn't it? It's, yeah. It's, yeah, I just delved into that. February's birthstone, also the um, um, stone of Valentine's, remember. It's February's not too far away. You know what it's like. Once January starts, it flies by at first, doesn't it? I am bringing to you two indulgent strands, both Zambian origin. What does Zambian amethyst say to you that maybe Brazilian amethyst doesn't? Zambian, it, it gives you that richness, that that depth of colour that you know it's it's recognisable to mm. me. And I think once once anybody starts with with jewellery making, you do tend to recognise your amethyst very very quickly mm. if you're buying from jewellery maker just because of the quality. Yeah, yeah. And that's the great thing. It is a quality product that we bring to you. What does purple and gold say to you? Oh, it's regal. Yeah. Regal, decadence, you know, expensive. 
It's most certainly a luxury look, isn't yes. it? I love the way that because of the highly faceted stones here, you're always getting that reflection actually from the gold. And I don't know if you can see, but the gold's actually kind of picking up some of the yes. purple colors as well. It looks executive. It looks expensive. It's very much that sort of ornate 1920s pairing, isn't it? It's got that sort of decadence of, of uh, you know, velvet um, in the purple colour. And then that beauty of that almost sumptuous 18 karat gold looking wire. I love that you've looked at this as a decadent pairing and yes. you've gone to town with your jewellery. Oh, yeah, yeah. It, it was just, it was a pleasure to make that piece. It was, you know, it's just like, let's just really go for it mm. really show off that amethyst and i still had am lots of amethyst left left as well even after making you know such a, a gemstone heavy piece and that is very gemstone yes. heavy where would you think of wearing something like this <gasps> new year's eve maybe something, something like that mm. yeah some something that's it's quite grand mm. yeah yeah real grandeur real luxurious isn't that just next level it's stunning isn't it so expensive in its look, and understandably so. There has got to be a serious amount of carat weight on there, considering of the amethyst rice beads, uh, which are 10 by 15, you're getting 270 carats worth on that strand alone. Also, that you're getting 80 carats worth of the Zambian amethyst in the six mils. So there's big carat weights here, big statements, big phone yeah. calls. This is also one of those pieces that I would make to have on my jewellery stand if I was selling mm. and I would have that as a real showcase piece you might not sell it on the day but if you have that high up on your stand and it's got all those gemstones it's got that decadence of gold it's going to attract people and people will know it's amethyst know that you've got your real gemstones your genuine gemstones on your store it, it will cause an attraction and you never know you might sell it as well yeah yeah but so please true. do price accordingly there's a lot, a lot absolutely of in there. absolutely do yeah. I wish we'd pay attention to price accordingly yeah. because you know that we're not stopping there on price. We could, most certainly, with the indulgence that this Zambian Amethyst collection offers. But today, we're live on air. It's a guest designer kit. We like to give you a treat. That is over wow. 16 pounds back into your pocket for a real extensive amount of your genuine gemstones. Look at that sparkle and that beauty and that intensity and look at the way in which against the gold, these just come into their own. It's something luxury looking, isn't it? I love those. I will just let you know that we are going to be going on into the mandrel very, very soon, but we are going to be demonstrating with this. Uh, Katie, we're looking at that beautiful bangle. Yeah, aren't we're going we? to make we're going to make that bangle. First of all, we're going to make the little charms that are there. So now, can you just tell me, um, charms, are they something which you have seen have always been popular or do you think they're something which has become more popular? I think they've always been popular, but I think definitely now because there's so many charm companies out there mm. that are doing this and making a lot of money out of it, definitely, definitely jump, jump on that bandwagon and, and make lots and lots of charms. And this is the sort of thing that you can have made up. You can have lots and lots of different charms made up mm. and maybe have... A bit like those companies do. You, you have your, your bracelet almost made up because you need to add your charms. Mm -hmm. And then maybe have lots and lots of bracelets made up, lots and lots of charms made up and say, so much for your bracelet, so much for your charms. I'll make it up for you in the next five minutes. Love that. Yeah. And then you choose. Yes. I will just let you know that the Lady in Black collection is this one here that is currently on, uh, that we're going to be working with and the graphics currently on screen. You've got the... Um, 10 meters of the one mil here. This is in your silver. You've also got the silver in the 0 0.6 and you've got those two strands. And yes, that is a genuine big, bold spinel. Uh, we gave you a 44% discount on an already discounted price. Let's head on over to Katie. Okay, so um, initially I'm gonna make the little spinel charm. So, okay, so. We've got our 0 0.6, so I've just got probably about 10 centimetres of that, so, mm. so we can make our charm. And we're going to make a head pin, but what I'm going to do is, because we don't have head pins in the kit, I'm using the very, very tip of my round nose pliers okay. just to create, just start turning it right, right at the tip, and just to create that little loop just on the end there. So now I've got that, that loop there. I'm just going to pop my chain nose pliers in and straighten that up just so it's more like a, a lollipop hoop. Like so. So 
can see there we've got just that little loop just on there mm. okay so that is essentially a head pin it's not it it would be like an eye pin but because that loop's so small it's just going to act like a little head pin so we could add something on there if we wanted to so you can see your spinel just goes straight onto your 0 0.6 wire mm. no problem at all and from there we're just going to add a little wrap loop so i'm going to pop my pliers in pop a little kink to one side so i've got that angle there Pop my round nose pliers in, so I want I don't want it right at the tip this time because it's going to have to go onto the one mil wire. I'm going to take that all the way around to the opposite side, reposition my pliers, take that underneath, take those pliers out, and then holding with my flat nose or chain nose pliers and just very gently wrap that around. And because it's a 0.6, it's very very easy, malleable to do. That's good. Yeah. And then we're going to snip that off and that's our little charm made. The only thing I would say is just make sure you nip in that little end bit there. Okay, so that's one charm made. Now easy we're going to make peasy. this little heart really quickly. And we're just going to use a couple of inches of the one mil wire. We want it quite small. Okay, and we're going to pop our round nose pliers in, in the center, and then bring these up together. Okay, and because we've kind of gone in the centre, we can judge it so that we get it dead centre. And then we want to cross those over so we get that little loop at the bottom there. Okay, so that's the bottom part of our heart. And then we're going to take our round nose pliers and turn inwards into this, into this V shape. So turning inwards and then do the same at the other side. Like so. Okay, and then I'm going to grab the outside of this loop, not the inside, the outside of this loop. And just holding everything firmly, I'm going to bring this around to start making my heart shape. So just holding this outside and bringing this in. So our little heart shape is beginning to take shape. And then just using your pliers just to manipulate it and bring it right into, into that shape. So we've got a little heart shape. This is probably a little bit bigger. Probably go with a little bit less wire. I mean, one on, my one on the actual piece is a little bit smaller, but we've got a little heart shape there. So that's ready to go. And then I've just made a jump ring from the, um, from the one mil wire. So all I'm gonna do is open that jump ring. Whoop. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop it onto this part. So the part that's uh, actually on the side, because that's where we want that to be. And we want these to kind of come quite close together so that it's not going to come apart. So we want this to sit on the outside of there. So we've got my little charms ready. So now we're going to move on and start looking at the actual bracelet itself. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm going to take my mandrel. Now this is something I would normally kind of do on my knee. So We'll, um, we'll do it up here. Tell you what, whilst we're doing yeah. that, let me just let you know. I'm bringing a mandrel as well. Yeah. Why are you using this mandrel for this design? Because, that makes sense. because it's metal and I can work hard and onto it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I can hammer onto it. It's not going to damage the mandrel whatsoever. And we can work hard and onto it and, and really get a really good shape. Mm -hmm. If we were to use a wooden one and then try and hammer onto it, we're going to damage damage the wood okay. and things. So we, so we can use, either use a rawhide hammer or we can use a ball pane hammer mm -hmm. and get texture on it as well. So it, it gives us a really good base to work mm -hmm. on. Okay. And, and it's this a nice one, heavy. Obviously, yeah. you're working with the round. This one is the oval. Yes. Tell us why the variation what is the difference yeah, this obviously one's going to give you that perfect one, circle your bangle shape your perfect circle that one is an absolute essential if you're going to make cuff bracelets especially yeah, because but your wrist isn't can't. round yeah. is no, it no no so some people prefer it like like this is a round bracelet and it, it sits it sits as a round um but if you wanted to, you could make this bracelet and the bracelet like something like this, mm -hmm. that oval shape, and it would give you that more natural fit. Yeah. So it, it's it's definitely your own taste, and and I would definitely tr you know try and have as many options. So as that's possible. what this oval yes. one would yes. do for yeah, you. That's, that's that's mainly my go-to one. But if I'm gonna if I want it to be around, then I'd go for around. But that is my go-to one for nearly all my cuff bracelets. So this is the mandrel um, that we are essentially working with. You've got the graduation inside. 
sizes in here, as you can see. And as we've, as, as uh, lovely Katie was just saying there, you're gonna see in a moment how you can use this and what the benefit of this being metal as it is, is. Um, we have got for you, not the wooden design, the metal design, it is hollow. So it isn't um, dead heavy, but yeah. it's sturdy, isn't it? It is, it is very, very sturdy. It's a piece of equipment that once you buy, that's it. You're not gonna. You're not gonna have to buy another one. No, it's, it's gonna. It's gonna last. Really it's cool as well because there's not bits to like fall off it. Or you no. were saying before you dropped your pliers, didn't you? And the springs got a bit yeah. funny oh, on no. it. Gutters. Yeah. Um, gutters. Something like this. It doesn't. No. no it doesn't just matter don't drop it on your foot or anything. Like no. That. No. Don't do that. We have got your metal bracelet bandrel. Just as a little reminder, and I know I do this all the time, and but the fact that it's um, graduated as well, so we yes. can go go from sort of you know the very small. Because some people do have a very very tiny wrist. And yeah, of course. Sort of like like a gent size as well. Yeah. yeah. At the top of this section here, uh, have we got my ruler of truth? I was just looking for it, but I can't see it. But from the top, from my memory, it goes from around about six inches um, all the way. I oh, I could use a macram. Oh, A up my ruler oh, of truth. Thank it. you, Dan. Um, so yeah, you're looking at around about 13 centimeters at the finest point. And at the largest point, I've only got a tiny ruler, but uh, 15 plus eight, so uh, 23. So centimeters, about 13 centimeters, 23 centimeters. So although it almost doesn't look like there's a big graduation yeah, when you first look at it, it's because it's yeah. quite gentle, which is great for this. It's a real big graduation. So lots of different sizes, lots of different people. And literally you could make christening bracelets yes. all the way up to anklets. Oh gosh, yeah. Easily. Yeah. Bringing it to you today, your £19,095. Great, great price. And the price of the postage on this, I mean, elsewhere, you're going to be paying a lot of postage for this. These items, and I remember speaking to uh, Marie about this, these are the items that we, when we post them, we are instantly losing money on our yeah. PMP. Instantly. Yeah. Even if this is the only thing you bought today, we would still lose money yes. with the PMP. So it, it's just so weighty, it's so sturdy, it's so heavy, it's so workable. And you're going to see how we can work it right now. Okay. So I've got a length of my one mil wire and it's about 30 centimetres long. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm going to go for around about the middle. So I'm going to bring it around. Okay. And then I'll just turn it over. So I'd normally do this kind of holding in my hands right, right in front of me, but I'm doing it this way for the camera, okay? So I've got quite a lot of wire there, it's probably a little bit too much. Probably cut off a little bit too much. But what I do is I tend to hold it so it's kind of coming about, about two thirds of the way around this second lot of wire. So I've got kind of a third showing here, mm -hmm. yeah? And then what I can do is I can snip off here and here. Okay, so I've got a section that's got no uh, one single wire and then at this side I've got two wires. Now what I want to do is while it's on, on here, I want to kind of work harden it a little bit, but I don't want to work harden these little sections, just the ends here, because I'm going to make loops out of those. Okay. So just for a few, few seconds, I'm going to use a rawhide hammer for now. And I'm just, all I'm doing is hitting the wire against the metal. Okay, and then turn. What if you don't have a rawhide hammer? You can use a ball, ball pain ha hammer, mm -hmm. definitely. Uh, we, we've got um, the whammer hammers and, th and things like that. But you don't want to be damaging you, your, your metal. If you want to add texture, what I do is work harden it a little bit first and then add some texture to it. Okay. Now Why is it, it is important to work hard? And because one? if we if we take I just uh, grab a piece of one mil wire. If we take a piece of one mil wire there, I, because we, our wire is so brilliant, it's, it's very malleable, mm -hmm. okay? But if we ha work hard on it, the more we work hard on it, the less malleable it becomes. Mm -hmm. So it forms that nice bracelet, bracelet shape, mm -hmm. okay? So now we've got this shape here. So I can take that out and you can see I've got that fantastic circular shape. Now wire's got a little bit of memory, so it will spring back a bit, but we don't need to worry about that too much at the moment. And that, it already feels different. It has mm. that different feel to it already just from that little bit of work hardening. Right, so what I'm gonna do is looking at, looking at this and we've got one wire on this side and then this wire is the, the wire that comes around to here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go around about a centimeter in and then turn that end in towards 
the opposite side so it's coming towards this side mm -hmm. okay like so and then I'm going to do the same at the other side so I'm going to turn it around and so this shorter wire is going to come in towards again so holding that like so and in towards so I've got two wires coming in towards okay now I'm going to pop one of the wrapped loops uh, the loops are not wrapped loops mm. and then I'm going to add my charms and then and then finish off okay so I'm going to make a little loop so just ignoring that other side just for a second and using either some what you want is your loops to be even as well so using the baling plier is quite good if you haven't got a baling plier if you use your round nose pliers but use the same point on the on the pliers okay so just moving that side just out of the way for a second so you want quite a, a the smaller size it is and turning this just so that we get that loop yeah if you do want to recreate around. something like this i have got the three by five balers here so with this one you would use the smallest yes yes so i'm just going to open that up a little bit 495 about that and then pop my wire inside and then close up that loop again okay so then I've got my little loop and that's where my wire is coming through now at this point is where I'm going to add my charms so I'm going to pop them onto this little section here you can have your charms on the other side so they swing all the way around but I quite like them to keep them together so they're not kind of moving around too much okay so my charms are on there and then I'm just going to create that other little loop on the other side. So just starting to turn that. Okay, so I'm not going to connect it in straight away because I want my loops to be the same size. And then opening up that loop and then hooking that around. So this side will be a little bit trickier just because you've already got that other wire in the other side. So there we go. And then we can close that loop. Okay. And then we've got both charms on that little section there. And then you can you can go back in if you wanted to at this point and work hard on it a little bit more if you needed to. You could add some texture to this wire as well once it's work hard and with mm. you you kind of the ball pain side side of your your hammer. Yeah, and it's that there you go. I just think that's amazing. Do you mind if I put that on? Yeah. Just so people can see. Yeah, and the more you wear it, the more kind of um, work hardened it becomes Completely. as well. Completely. Yeah. Just look at that. And I love the fact that where, when you wear this, as you can see, because you put the charms in the centre there, those charms aren't going to be hidden around the back or yeah. whatever. They're going to yeah. stay within yeah. that section. And you can section. alter the size really easily. Yeah. So if you've got something that's got a, a lot a smaller tighter. wrist, mm -hmm. you can make it a little bit higher up on your mandrel. I just think that's so yeah. gorgeous. And you could definitely fab, make this style bracelet on your this shape mandrel, definitely, right. because you could have you're just going to have that section on sort of your you know flattened side of your, your oval. Got you. Yeah. And this is another brilliant thing about this as well. Remember that it is kind of a one size fits all deal. Yes. You don't have to worry about clasps or anything no, else like no. that. No. So it's it's the sort of thing again going back to if you are selling on craft fairs, it's the sort of thing that people will buy for as a mm. gift because they know they don't have to worry about the size. Yeah. Yeah. It's brilliant. I love that. Thank cool. you so much. Um, we're going to have more makes coming up from Katie. Still a few of them in baskets. Uh, I've got these that have absolutely flung all over the show. Could I give you one to play yeah. with? Or all of them. Uh, yes, no, I'll take one, one yeah, or several. No, no, no. Tell you what, we'll because I've got one. this as a star buy. And I think it's always nice when pieces are bold and unusual like this to see what could be done. Yeah, so keep do your it. peepers peeled. We'll do this in a few minutes for you. And then um, later on, we'll have a look at what Katie's been playing with. Okay, let me move on and let's give you something very decadent because let's remember, this was the kit that has just gone off screen. It was the black spinel in there and we were talking about how high-end and luxurious the black spinel was. A lot of you will understandably think black spinel and think that deserves serious quality. Shen Silver. That would be phenomenal together, right? Solid sterling silver, five full meters worth. And this is in your 0 0.4. Now, let me remind you, when we're dealing with wire, such as the wire work that Katie's been showing us, we have different thicknesses, we have different gauges. 
And what we're bringing to you is 0.4. So this is a beautiful weaving wire. You can see how malleable that is. There you go, look at that. Isn't that just beautiful? So malleable, which means that if you use it with a thicker sturdier wire, you can get really nice intricate details. Great thing about 0.4 as well is that you can use it as a standalone. For example, place it through a stone, do a little wrap loop on it, not too dissimilar from what Katie showed us um, earlier on. Uh, do a loop and do the same at the side and then make lots of links with them. So it can become like a basis of a chain. It's a very useful size. The fact it goes through a lot of your gemstones helps as well because obviously different size gems, different size drill holes. What I'm bringing to you here is five meters worth of this. That means you're getting five, no, tell a lie, six and a half grams worth of your precious metal. And this is precious metal. I would say to you too, that if you're into making your own head pins, you can essentially with a 0.4 make your own featherweight head pins. All you need is your blowtorch, your safety equipment, and we've seen it done on air a few times, haven't we? And essentially what you'll do is you'll hold the flame around this section here and relatively quickly, this section will begin to recede and it will then form a ball at the end, therefore creating your own featherweight head pins. Great thing about doing it that way is you can make as long or as short as you need and you're gonna be able to get a lot out of five meters. Today, giving you workability and quality. Anyone else remember when we used to do one meters of wire at £21.95 for a slightly bigger gauge? Five meters at 9 95 That's incredible. We used to bring you 0.8 at £21.95 for a meter. Now, I'm not saying this is a 0.8, is it? Of course, it's not. It's not quite, but about half the thickness for all intensive purposes. But even then, even if we were to half that price, let's say take it down to what, £11 per meter for something like this. £11 per meter. Yeah. Five meters so, though. Yeah, so for me to make quite a, a detailed weave uh, cuff bracelet, yes. I could probably make two very detailed cuff bracelet Gorgeous. weaves. So all you would need is, is your base wire to go with. Yeah. And it's a fiver per bangle of silver that yeah. you've used. I mean, really, loads of you in. I've got multi buyers in as well. Don't forget that if you do your um, express delivery, I although I can't guarantee it by Christmas, I can get it to you before New Year. So for the crimbo limbo makes that that bit in between Christmas and New Year yeah. where you're you know half a stone heavier and you've um, you're not speaking to half your family because you've fallen out and um, you're maybe you've played all of the board games yeah. possible and you vow never to play board games again um, you know in that time in between Christmas and New Year where in the nicest way you're kind of relaxing but twiddling your thumbs a bit making luxury yes. jewellery for the new year. Yeah, I mean, set yourself a task to, to make yourself a sterling silver bracelet. Totally, yeah. completely. Yeah, I said that before actually, Daddy. The, the, the Crimbo Limbo is that time where you don't know what day it is. You haven't got a clue. You don't know the day, you don't know the date. You, you know, it, it all just becomes a blur, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm gonna have to set an alarm for my next show because Otherwise, I'm not going to You're just going to, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, we've got 9.95 for you today. Five metres worth today. Great deal. Plenty of you in on this. And remember, this you could use alongside these road like garnets that I did earlier on. Should have been uh, about £80 pounds they were, weren't they? Took them down dramatically in price for you today. If you do want to seize the moment on them, I encourage you to do so. I'll give you the code now if you want. Sorry, tell a lie, they were £90. £89.95, reduce them to £29.95. GBVR57 on those, good luck. Okay, let's do it. I have got for you now a bold, bold beauty. I do apologise, my strand did break earlier on. 
Already Katie's made something with one, even though I gave it to you moments ago. What I've got for you here are big, bold, focal pieces. These to me have a globe-like beauty about them. Every single one is individual, every single one with serious character, and every single one deserves to be a focal piece in your jewelry collection. <laughs> These are so dynamic and dramatic. They've almost got a sea glass look to some of them when you lift them up to the light. They do come on a strand, but as you saw, mine are disintegrated slightly. Um, what I'm bringing to you here is just noteworthy pieces. Look at this, scenic beauty in a stone. Gorgeous, isn't it? Isn't that beautiful? Aqua agate. That's almost like sort of a glacier-like beauty, isn't yes. it? And this is what I was saying, you know, there are some that are quite striking in this manner and, and make you think of the coolness, icy beauty with almost that internal druzy. And then there are some that just go, holiday, holiday, holiday. Yeah. You know, Aruba, Curacao, the Caribbean, Nassau, those kind of colours. It's bright, it's bold. And then we alter it again. Let's go more icy, more, more almost cloudy day. Polar bear-esque. You have got that beauty on these ones too. And I think that's the great thing about this strand. Whether you want party, party, tropical, happy days, other days, or you want frozen rivers, cooling, relaxing, tranquil, you've got it on this strand. We have got beautiful 750 carats worth, which means that every single one of these three mil coins is dynamic, beautiful, effortless brightness. So if you do fancy getting ready for those lovely summer months, you've got it here, or you can just keep it cool and winter ready. Either way, you've got some beautiful pieces here. We are offering to you all, good question, let me count them, I've just found one. Two, four, six, eight, ten. 11, 12, 13, I've got on my strand. 13 on my strand, might be more, might be less, but around 13 for you. Your price point for, let's face it, something like this. Sorry, so how much is that each? How much would you sell something like that for? On a cord. On a cord. Macquarie slider knot or something maybe at the yeah. back. Between 15 and 20. Happy days. Yeah. Fact of the matter is it's actually cost you about one pound fifty-three at that price. 99p. Approximately wow. 99p per gem for you now. That's fantastic, isn't it? That's brilliant. Let's say I used a meter of do you know what? Let's go loop. Let's go loop. A meter of, of this wire, Danny's saying, would be yeah. how much pop it? One ninety nine plus the ninety nine p. Brilliant. That's just fab. I think that is such a great price, and I love that you've yeah. whipped up so not just one a, but just two just pieces. A little connector. So, oh, so I'm thinking maybe you could teeth. have that onto a chain, maybe a tassel underneath it. You know, just really simple jewellery, but you know, really really easy to do, and it just looks amazing. And I love this because it's reversible wire. the way you've done it. Yeah. Wow, that's really clever, isn't it? So is that, is that one continual piece of wire? Yeah, yeah, they're both one continual piece. And this one's different, look. That's so clever. That's a really nice pair, actually. Let, as, as that's like, say, a, a bracelet connector and that could be a necklace, yeah. how would you do a pair of earrings to finish this set? You don't have to use the gemstone, obviously, but how would you complete like a motif, maybe, of earrings with this? Give me two seconds. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, I will. Yeah. I absolutely will. I'll just do will. one earring then. All right, yeah, completely. <laughs> yeah. 
Grab these ones whilst you have the opportunity to do so. It is $12.95. Let me show you, actually, whilst you're there, because I did show these together before, let me just borrow this again. How about... I mean, I love the way that looks together. Yeah, that's it's yeah. so ethereal again, isn't it? Yeah. Looks expensive, looks high end. The rose quartz itself has enough personality about it, doesn't it? To sort of stand up against yes. uh, these ones. I just think they're so dynamic. I just want to let you know again, beautiful rose quartz, delicate, very intuitive and skilled micro facets are coming up for you in about 21 and a half mins. Um, reason I'm letting you know that is for the fact that I am doing it as tonight's big must have. And I will let you know too, that actually for a strand like this, as we were saying earlier on, 32 pounds as they used to be, 19.95 as they were. I'm actually gonna go under a tenner tonight and I don't mean by a five pence. So well worth keeping your peepers peeled on that one today. So um, we'll have a little nosy at your earrings in a moment or two. Um, let me uh, grab my tablet for a moment or two because I mentioned this on the mid-show earlier on and um, I do just want to make it very clear and very fair for everyone. So let me just show you really quickly a, um, um, a, a film, essentially, a moment of a show, which was myself and the wonderful Mineral Man, Alex. I did have this lined up and standard procedure, what happened, I clicked it and uh, I zipped past it. Um, two seconds. Da -da -da -da. So in this show, essentially, we spoke about how... Um, how the mineral man himself brings to us very high-end, beautiful stones from all over the world. Um, what we're catching at the end of this on the show that we did, um, myself and Alex did, the mineral man, um, we caught the end of this, um, we're just at the end of a labradorite moment now. And uh, what I'm gonna do is I'll hit play on this in a second. And then once I do, we'll start talking about Amazonite. So I just want you to keep your ears peeled if you can. Which ones did you say? Amazonite. This is a, a really... Rare, it's a, it, it, well, it's, it's, a, it's a difficult stone to get in nice quality, Amazonite. So Amazonite is generally, well, an opaic gemstone. And yeah. I always think it's quite difficult to explain to people in opaque gemstone what good quality is and what isn't. Because with a gemstone that might have clarity, it's yes. almost easier. Yeah. What to you is good quality? Well, the Amazonite there, again, it's it's a feldspar. Mm -hmm. it's, so it's the same family as Labradorite. Mm -hmm. But again, it's it's got to have good quality, good colour. Yes. And if you can see, it should can have a bit of chatoyancy. Can you see that she chatoyancy? The chatoyancy. If it's got some uh, nice chatoyancy, um, that's nice quality. Again, you can get very pale amazonite. Um, the very, very best was in from came from Russia. Okay. But I think it's been mined out now. So it was it was done uh, many years ago. Mm -hmm. um, so it just pay attention to that for a moment. Russian amazonite. It was mined out. It was mined out a while ago. I have got the last we have in the business, and this is the last. I've just started talking. We have got the last in the business. We have got your final opportunity. We have not been able to repurchase in from this time. I am so limited in stock that genuinely, 100%, we bought these in for you a while ago. Like, you know, that was um, that was in May, and I know that we had these on that week. So this was May, January, February, March, April, May, yeah. May, we've had them in. We have not made a purchase since then. I've now got two because someone already checked out. Let's do it. Your price point today, $24.95 should be. Wow. This is a mind out stone. 
17 pounds and 95 pence we genuinely since may haven't been able to buy any of this when at I all when i saw these today i was over, so over excited because they're, okay. they're amazing Saturated. absolutely amazing yeah i've got uh fastest finger first it's gone this these shouldn't really have price drops at all just because they are completely done um yeah we we literally wow. haven't been able to buy any for us to not be able to buy anything from them it's madness I've um, got a few more of these ones. I uh, only had three or four of the other ones, but uh, I've got slightly more of these, but I do have less than 30. Bringing to you 80 carats worth. This is your six mil. It's the strength of color, as you heard us talk about. The strength of color is what you want. Amazonite doesn't normally look this huge, doesn't normally look this color. Amazonite generally, not quite this, but is more this kind of hue when we see it. Totally natural, big, bold color. Your price point today, less than 25 now. 19.95. Wow, doing price drops. 16 pounds and 95 pence. Remember, the fact of the matter is, we do not for a moment really have to do price drops on these. We are well aware that this mine is done, it's dusted. We're quite aware that we haven't since well, May, as I said, been able to buy anything. But even then, we didn't buy these in May. We brought them to air in May. We bought them, you know, a few months before. So it's amazing that we're bringing these to you full stop. This yeah. is unlike any other Amazonite. Yeah, it's amazing, Amazonite. It's the best, hands down, best I've seen. I completely agree with you. I completely agree with you. Oh, that looks so pretty. It's the beauty and the strength that juxtaposes so yeah. nicely. That is just an incredible strength. Not surprised that this is the most popular Amazonite yeah. in the planet. Oh, absolutely. What would you do with this size, the six mil? Oh, this size. Less than I 20. Would, I would be tempted to, to channel set that into some sterling silver. Using your, Gorgeous your, idea. Your 0 0.4 wire, channel set it into some sterling silver and have a really beautiful bracelet. Gorgeous yeah. idea. Sold out of the other one, coming close to a sellout on this one too. How many of these do I have now? Okay, so just over 10, 11, 12 by the looks of things. Good luck. It's the last shot you're going to have on those ones today, we think. Um, and if you are watching on the repeat, they probably have all sold out, but it is always worth a go. You've yeah, got to be in it to win checking. it. This one is the most dainty. Oh. Four mil on these ones. The strength, the quality. I've got 16 of this one. Good luck one and all. 30 carats worth today. Totally natural. As uh, Alex said, you know, mind out gemstone. Your price point today. 995 oh, wow. for the final 15 now. That is just an incredible deal. Yeah, I would channel set these into some hoop earrings. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, really nice. And if you're not going to use the sterling silver with it, I'd definitely go with copper. Oh, copper, really? Let that yeah, zing? Yeah. Mm. Copper would look amazing with it. When you're looking at this stone, I mean, even if you just look at the Amazonite uh, that I'm showing, let me try not to make myself talk again. Oh, blimey, I look happy there. Look at that big face. Like that. <laughs> uh, let me try and find the Amazonite, just because I want to show you the variation in colour. This is our general everyday colour of Amazonite. Look at the variation. This, it's dramatic. This is intense, isn't it? Compared. Yeah. It's really dramatic. It's really different. And that is why, you know, the likes of Alex is saying how you know this is was so big so bold that it, it yeah. was gone you know and remember lovely alex i think when we did that show we were talking when we were doing that show we were talking about um where he was off to and was he off to brazil like the next day something like that and he'd just gone back from hong kong or something like that yeah. and then um, he travels all over, you know, and he's got really good connections but the fact of the matter is he cannot purchase yeah. russian hams and that Right now, we haven't been able to. We haven't been able to in ages. Um, just to let you know, I've got four left now, and that is it. Three now, three available now. First one sold out. I've got a quarter of the, uh, like, 11-ish um, left of the previous strand, and uh, we've got loads of you in on these, a lot of you multi-buying. I would be multi-buying as well on these. We're not going to be able to get this again. Mm -hmm. No, you wouldn't. No. Absolutely not on your Nelly. Good luck. I am over allocated now. That is a stunner. 10 minutes approximately until the rose quartz. Oh, let me see. Oh, I oh, love those little, earrings. Yes, yeah, so it's very similar to the pendant, but just... Uh, that is brilliant. Yeah, I only made one. <laughs> but to give you an idea, yeah. doesn't it? 
So that is a collection. Yeah, you could have the bracelet, earrings, pendant. That's beautiful. That is absolutely yeah. stunning, isn't it? Popping that wire back on the 0 0.4 in case you want to use it with the Amazonite. The drill hole is big enough for you yes. to put larger in, but um, obviously, you know, 0 0.4 is fantastic for the quality of the Amazonite as well. Love those colours. Aren't they fabulous? Katie, thank you so much for doing them. Welcome. Aren't they beautiful? Okay, let me remind you of a few things. Not long until this. Well done, by the way, everyone on Russian Amazonite. That is a scarcity, to be honest. Not long at all until I'm going to bring you this treasure. Also remember that I've got coming up for you some Swarovski. But for now, let me stick with the wonderful myriad of colours and let me bring to you opal. Now, these are opal cabochons and these are by far the largest opal cabochons I've seen us bring to you. Eight full carats worth in total we're gonna um, offer to you here and the quality we're offering is exemplary. Let me just rem remind you really quickly that when we're dealing with opal, the general rule is if you can see color in them when they're not moving and you're not moving, then already you're looking at an A grade quality. And here's the second point to remember. When you're looking at these, how many colors can you see? So I need to pick one up and I want you to assess it yourself. If you can see, this is a general rule. Different people have different grading systems on, um, on opal let's remember a lot of people have different grading systems for different gems the only one that's kind of standardized is is diamond but a lot of people will say if you are seeing three colors in a stone then instantly you've got a triple a grade quality are we seeing three different colors or more anyone else seeing purples Purples. I know we always say, don't yeah, we, you know, red means money, red. red is the rarest, but be honest, how many purples do you see in purples, opal? Purples, blue, red, yeah. green. Yeah. There's definitely some yellow flashes. In definitely. Yeah. This is in a daylight simulator, remember? Um, because we've got to remember that the light's in here. It's like living in some bed shop. Oh, blimey. Opal doesn't like it. Uh, but this is in a daylight sort of replication booth, if you will. <laughs> and that goes to show um, how these will uh, look when you're wearing them, especially sort of around twilight time of an evening. I had these as a challenge a few weeks ago. Wow. So, yes. Uh, they're treat? absolutely beautiful to work with really quite quite easy to work with I, I i just netted them but if you were to have the gallery wire so so simple to use it'd be sensational so, so isn't simple it? to use really really beautiful absolutely stunning I'll pick that one or we haven't seen Every that one single yet one. i think on that night we, we had about three or four different samples in the studio and it was were, every single every one. Every single one was phenomenal. Love that. Bringing to you eight full carrots. That means very easily I'm looking at about two carrots as an average across the board, which is massive for an opal. Natural Ethiopian opal, and it is a deal and a half. That is your start price. Let me remind you. You will get that different that shapes is incredible. as well because we've got a round here and an oval, and, and in the one that I had, I had a little pear shape. So, yeah. That's lovely. So, so that's a great point to yeah, make, actually. Yeah. Variation in the sizes and the shape. So that makes it interesting. Yeah. That price point on your screen is a phenomenal price. That price point you've just witnessed is sensational. But today, 69 95 because we're live on air, because it's an on-air deal, because we want to give you a treat before the weekend, and because we are getting you ready for the clearance. Oh, yeah, you heard. Uh, we've got so much going up for you this weekend. £69.95 pence for you today. Eight carats worth of your Ethiopian opal with your multi-shape cabochons. And we have got £69.95. I think that's an astonishing deal. It's an amazing deal. Absolutely, hands down, one of the best Ethiopian opals Agreed. I've ever had the pleasure to, to work with. Mm. Amazing, mm. absolutely amazing. It's just beautiful, 69 95 If you do fancy grabbing them, you know what to do. Info's at the bottom of your screen, 0800 644 655. Also, jewelrymaker.com. Don't forget, if you love sparkle and shine, ooh, not mong. The 
before all that though, um, just to remind her for you, I have got more demonstrations coming up from this lovely lady. I have also got this beautiful rose quartz on its way. This and so much more are coming up for you straight after this break. This Sunday at three o'clock, JM gave to me Silver chain, bundles, triple finding steals Double mystery bundle, triple pack collection Double connector bundles, silver mystery charms Triple bead deals, one fed of blues Trivia mystery wires, lots of threading packs Mystery gemstones, and a parcel of luxury gems Did you know, no matter how many times you purchase with Jewelry Maker in the same day, you'll only be charged one fee of postage and packaging. Select our standard delivery for just $3.95, or if you'd like to receive your goods sooner, upgrade to our premium option for $5.95. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Our brand new Get Started with Jewellery Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewellery making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewellery designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash getstartedwithjm where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewellery making questions, offer inspiration and get you started in your jewellery making journey. Jewellery Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Love Jewelry Maker but don't have an account? You can now purchase items on the Jewelry Maker website through our guest checkout. To do so, select the products you wish to purchase and head over to the shopping basket. Simply enter your email address and select Continue as Guest below. After this, the checkout process is simple. Select your quantity and delivery option and then check out securely. Enter your billing details in either a credit card or PayPal account and proceed to payment. From here, you still have the option to create an account if you wish, making shopping online easier for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. The Jewelry Maker phone is free from a UK landline, so call us today to place your order. We get to bring to you such a varied amount of gemstones and what I love with us here at Jewelry Maker is over the years I think we've proved our ethos year after year after year. When we first started um, here at Jewelry Maker we would always talk about the fact that if we get a good deal we will pass that great deal on and uh, we get good deals and we always have because we essentially cut out the middleman whenever we can. We go to the fairs, we go to the shows, we go to different um, wonderful exotic countries all over the world to find you great quality, great deals. And when we get great quality, great deals, we pass them on. And that is something we've always stuck to. But I think sometimes it's time that proves that. And I cannot think of something clearer in a relatively short space of time that we have proved than with the skill of our artistry. 
not so many years ago, when we used to bring you two by one gemstones, the facet work would be described as micro facet because essentially you will have these beautiful, shining, lustrous moments on the surface of the gemstone, whereby the facet junctures would connect absolutely perfectly, even though it was on a miniature, minute scale. The skill, the level, the talent, the training that goes into creating that was massive, but it was worth it because it gave us spark, it gave us shine. It gave us light that moved presto, unlike any other facet on any other shape and any other size before, so it was worth it. And then we tell you all of this and the skill and the training and the level of time and commitment that facet work takes to deal on a relatively genteel and delicate stone and we would bring in a price, a start price of around £32.95 pence, and they would fly out the door. You'd be diving on them, you'd be appreciating them, you'd be multi-buying on them and then because you loved them so much and because they flew out, we thought, right, we need to go and get more. We went and got more, we bring you the same deal again and again and again and they kept selling out. We just thought, hang on, we're onto something here. Let's get more varied gemstones. Let's not just do the quartzes at 32.95 with the microfaceted. Let's do more luxurious ones, more unusual ones. Let's buy in bigger bulk. And we bought in bigger quantities and therefore we got a better deal. We got that better deal and therefore we were able to bring to you in, in the space of a year or so, the same strands essentially, not 32.95, but 19.95 and that was it. The clear quartz, remember though, rose quartz would be a bit more amethyst, a bit more than that and then we started doing garnets, etc. And they would be around the, the 27.95 mark, but still, amazing deal. Yeah. Bear that in mind for this. Must have. Serious skill and beauty. And look at that sparkle. That sparkle reaches new capabilities. That sparkle, that sheen, that beauty. Absolutely decadent. This is a strand that not only shows our skill and workmanship and dedication to bringing you serious glitz and glamour. I think it also shows to you, actually, this strand in particular, the qualities at which our gemstones now reach. I did not see an, a translucent rose quartz here until about 2017. First time I saw us do translucent rose quartz, first time. Before that, it's always been opaque. The fact that you've got here translucency, which means the light travels through beautifully, but also you've still got that strength of color, goes to show we are bringing you luxury, beauty of gemstone selecting, but also skill and respect for that facet work. Bear all that in mind because I've got about just less than 200. And in a minute from now, the graphics will be on air. This is a stone to behold. What you've got here is that almost morganite pink with that almost kunzite translucency. We have got for you that fiery beauty due to that wonderful facet work and again the quality of the stone if you want to see fire on a stone watch on recordings and watch at the back where it goes slightly out of focus that is how you can tell if a stone has fire or not and as you can see this one genuinely really does as you're seeing that recording you're looking at the back the colors that you see of the golds and the pinks and the purples in those flashes that goes to show you've got translucency in the stone but also st skill of cut we have selected the gemstone for you, we faceted it with, with skill, and in about four seconds, the graphics will be live. So good luck all, because this is something which is a beauty, this is something which is decadent, this is something which I believe has really been on a journey with us over the years, as I say, 32.95, and we genuinely all remember yes. those days, don't yeah, we? Absolutely. 
Genuinely, every single one of us, um, you know, in, in this team right now remembers those days. 32.95, absolutely fine for a micro faceted strand. Actually then 19.95, brilliant deal. I feel like what we're bringing here is that luxury exclusivity, that serious sublime sparkle, the way in which that light sort of, you know, pirouettes almost around the strand itself, but also that we're bringing you that phenomenal quality of your rose quartz that gives you strength and depth of natural color, remember, not dyed natural also it's not just the color it's the translucency the way the light shines through which is again natural that's not because we filled it it's natural the fact that these things are natural and that we've gone to that skill effort time and energy to create this beautiful strand if I were to bring this to you now at 1995, I would still be beating the price of five, six years ago, not less than that, four years ago. I would still be beating the price of that because 1995 used to be our quartz price. Plain quartz. You have to pay more usually for rose quartz. Good luck, everyone. Your price point today is going to take your breath away. I'm only doing this because it's tonight's must have. Good luck all. 2.95. You couldn't even buy a single, you know, um, um, bouquet of flowers. No. In fact, you couldn't even buy like a single long-stemmed rose no. for that price. Two pounds and ninety-five pence. That kind of price point. If you went to the cinema, you wouldn't be able to buy a small portion of popcorn Not for that. You wouldn't be able to buy a, a little mixture bag of sweets. That yeah. is two pounds and ninety-five pence. At two pounds and ninety-five pence. You'd be hard stretch to buy a key ring in a lot of places two pounds and 95 pence you would find it really 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 difficult to buy a um you know like family size pack of pop do you know yeah. what i mean two pounds and 95 pence you would be really really hard stretch to actually be able to buy like a tub of ice cream nowadays for yeah, that price yeah. you can't not, I mean, a good, not a good sub of not, a, not a well known branded one, no. Right. At that price point of £2.95, if you use that to put in your car in monetary value of fuel, you'd be lucky if it got you to the next supermarket and back again. <laughs> £2.95 is such a minimal, tiny amount of money, but this, unlike flowers, aren't going to wilt after a few days. These, unlike chocolates, aren't gonna go off after a time. These, unlike fuel, aren't firelight, fire night. They don't have a, if you use them, you can only use them a certain amount of times and then you're done. These are luxury, beautiful, lasting, high-end stones with skill and beauty at literally two pounds and 95 wow. pence. That's amazing. I've never, ever seen a, a microfacetist strand go that low. It's crazy. Isn't that wow. just absolutely incredible? I have got at 8 a.m. tomorrow, dog tooth amethyst. I think this would look sensational with amethyst. I see you're so, picking yeah, up some blue. So if you were to use that 0.4 sterling silver wire mm -hmm. and do this design, you could thread those on to the wire and have the rose quartz design on the front. That would be incredible. That would look amazing, wouldn't it? Absolutely that would be beautiful. astonishing. Yeah, I love that idea. That yeah. is such a brilliant, brilliant opportunity for you to grab. If I were to do a design with this, let's say I wanted to do a... Um, do you know what? Pretty much everyone is multi-buying here. Uh, Stephen's multi-buying, Mary is, Christine is, Jazz is. I don't think we've met before, Jazz. Hello, Jazz. Um, Susan is, Catherine is, Shan is, Francois is, Mona. Oh, no, Mona's just got one. Vanda is, Amy is, Sue is, um, Suzanne is as well. Glenda is multi-buying too. I've got Sue um, in Somerset who's multi-buying. I've got Jane who's multi-buying as well. And Julia, you're multi-buying. Those are just the multi-buying buyers most of you are multi-buying let's say i would say the vast majority of people are getting between well three and five i'd say as an average um if i were to get three strands of this 
What suite of jewellery? How could I use this in a suite, please? Uh, in a suite of jewellery, you could you could make a bracelet. You could make a really beautiful, fine bracelet. You could uh, maybe rosary link with that the 0 0.4 wire, make a rosary link necklace. That would mm -hmm. be nice, really delicate earrings. But to be honest, what I would do, I'd be multi buying buying five plus, and I would be doing my seed bead embroidery, but not seed bead. I'd be doing gemstone embroidery. Can you imagine? Oh my goodness. Just explain that for anyone who's yeah. new what that so, is. So you would use a beading foundation. You'd maybe pop a cabochon on or, or one of the, these um, agates that we had. A, a, mm -hmm. it was mm -hmm. agate. Yeah, yeah. And then you could, you could uh, well, essentially seed bead around it, but you would actually be gemstoning around it, wouldn't you? Mm. So you'd be sewing them on with, with thread and uh, maybe peyoteing them around, around another gemstone. Mm. Really, you'd get such amazing sparkle, mm. amazing sparkle. What an opportunity. That's special, that isn't that it? That is really, really amazing. Got about half the stock gone, I'm being told on that one. So I do wish you all luck, because that... <sighs> Let me bring to you now some Swarovski cup chain. I love this one, because it's like the opalescent one. Yeah. What does the name Swarovski mean to you? Some of you will say sparkle. sparkle. Some of you will say shine. Some of you will say quality. Some of you might luxury. even think, yeah, yeah luxury. luxury. Yeah. Some of you might even be thinking about the price tags. When I was um, when I was in Vegas, they have a massive, massive right along the strip. They have a massive Swarovski store, and this Swarovski store has um, real sort of head-turning architecture to it. And the top of it is almost like an explosion of Swarovski crystals, and it looks like this. It is literally the silver set pieces of, of, um, of kind of their stones that are really highly captivating. When we're working with pieces like this, it is such a high-end element, which I don't know if you've seen the Swarovski ad campaign for Christmas. It's the uh, Naughty and Nice campaign. Have you yes. seen it? Yeah. The um, ad campaign, for those who haven't seen it, of Swarovski, it's essentially who's been naughty, who's been nice. And um, the um, naughty people wear the black, dark, deep gemstones and the nice people wear gemstones like this. Bright, bold, clean Swarovski cup chain, opalescent, rhodium brushed, remember, 50 centimeters in total. We're rolling it down now. One of the boldest ones we have, mind to 11 pounds and 95 pence. Oh, plot spoiler alert, sorry. 11.95, <laughs> there you go. 11 pounds and 95 pence today. What would you do with this, please? Uh, they look amazing, uh, macrame -ed. So, So using that as a, sort of your lazy strand, the macrame round in between. That's each a great one. So idea. It sets it more like a, like a tennis bracelet. And you can actually mm. macrame with your beading thread as well, which gives it that metallic look as well. That mm. looks great. I mean, just, just a simple drop. So you can cut them and um, you'll be able to kind of wiggle out that last little little piece of metal that joins it together. So it gives you a really nice finish and maybe just, just wrap some um, 0 0.4 wire around, create a, a wrap loop and straight onto a head pin and just have long drops. Amazing. Glam. Yeah. Seriously glam, right? If you want to treat yourself, £11.95 pence for you on this one. What do you think of the opal finish on these? Uh, it's my ultimate favourite colour, absolutely, for, for Swarovski. It's really? absolutely stunning. I've mm. had it in, in kits quite, quite often and they're absolutely beautiful. I think it's beautiful mm. luminosity, isn't it? Yeah. I think these are the types of Swarovski chain that you will see in an advert. You know, yes. you will literally imagine yeah. that with a clasp on the back and I'm you've got all of the... I'm imagining sort of one drop straight, straight down, down the middle of somebody's back. Yeah, totally. Yeah. So this is the type of one that, you know, makes me think of those adverts. Yes. Those beautiful, you know, generally women in those adverts, yes. isn't it? Those beautiful young ladies with something like this just draped down the back yeah, of a design. Because it does have that beautiful movement to it, that drape, that, mm. that gorgeous feel to it. So if you wanted to do that with something like this, one of these down the back, that would be beautiful for you to look at. But when I think of this, I think of the Swarovski brand for the adverts. When I look at these, I think about Swarovski for the crafters. Stop by.
Swarovski, the secret agent of the crystal world. Why? Because it's a closely guarded secret. Who, who is it? Which of our guest designers, partners works for a well-known Hoover brand? Hoover brand. Vacuum cleaner, sorry. Hoover's a brand already, isn't it? <laughs> Can't remember. Okay. But anyway, <laughs> we were chatting about that well-known Hoover brand. We talk about all sorts here. Uh, vacuum brand. Darn it! <laughs> uh, I don't think the brand is Hoover. No, uh, it was another. Um, but yeah, um, and they were saying how each component is, yeah. is made and it's kept very secret. It's exactly the same with Swarovski. So literally, for example, there will be a team of people in one room who will know how to actually use the machine that um, Daniel Swarovski himself came up with all of those years ago to cut the stones. Then there'll be someone who will know how to do, for example, the Aurora Borealis style of coating on one. Then there'll be someone who'll know, example, how to drill through these, and that goes to a whole different room. It's literally like different different skills and different yeah. uh, different stages. It's a magic look, but it's a magic skill, but boy, it gives a magic look. It's an amazing look, isn't it? Yeah, really lovely. What do you like about these gargantuan oh, 14 this, mil? I mean, the size, of, it's the impact that they have, isn't it? Mm. And those facets, they're, they're quite large facets and you get that flash of color just rainbowing through all, the, all that spectrum of color. Yeah. <gasps> Look at that when you spin it, that looks mm. amazing. Absolutely fantastic. Would you do movable jewelry with this? Yeah, I'd, I'd probably want, want them in the ears, just one on it, one on a head pin, just as exactly as you've got there. Mm -hmm. Long drop, maybe even onto a chain. <laughs> And just just letting them, them move and get all that movement so we get all that sparkle mm. and just maybe just one on a chain just mm. one single one on a chain around the neck mm. absolutely amazing they're just that is it. new year's eve isn't it yes it is yes do you know what this is it's like the um you know the ball that drops yeah, in new york they, yeah. in times square yeah it is it's proper yeah. isn't it it's new year's times square <laughs> Sarovsky aurora borealis 14 huge mil here, so just shy of a centimetre and a half, which means drama, it means dramatic beauty, it means more space to see all of that colour. It also means three individual pieces of jewellery if you want yes. it, or a pair of earrings and a pendant. Yes. They're bold enough, they're strong enough, they're yours today. Wow, that's fantastic. Just one at the top and maybe a tassel for a pendant. Yeah. Really gorgeous. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's just phenomenal, isn't it? Yeah. I love the way the way that you're doing that. So maybe a spinner pendant. So maybe some wire work around it and then have it have it so it's able to spin. Yeah. Getting all of that beauty yes. and all of that yeah, boldness. You definitely want that movement. Yeah. A hundred percent. That's just next level, isn't it? All of those colours. Oh, I adore it. By the way, speaking of colours, I can see you're getting ready for your next demo. Yes. yes. That strand is pretty special, isn't it? It's gorgeous, isn't it? I just, so many gemstones on that strand. Coming up for you very, very soon. Um, well done, everyone, on those. Okay. Let me show you. We did amethyst in your first kit, if you remember those um, sort of rice beads, those big faceted rice beads. If you like the look of this design, but you're thinking, do you know what? I like it, but I want something maybe a little bit more day wear. Do that design with... Oh, that, yeah, that's gonna make it just, just that little bit more delicate. Slightly more delicate. Yeah. Slightly more delicate. Yeah. Beautiful, right? And yeah, we were talking about purple and gold with that kit. So in that kit, in that necklace, do apologise. In that kit, in that necklace, do apologise. In that kit, in that necklace, um, you have obviously used the wounds of amethyst to sort of elongate the design. Yes. You could use these instead, yeah, couldn't you? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Mm. 
we have got for you 170 carats worth of your beautiful, deep and intense amethyst. It's Brazilian amethyst, so it's got, um, you know, a good lineage behind it. It's a very well-known, very resourceful location, which all, it, it, it's one of the dominating um, individual mines in, in, in the world, really because the ground is quite rich in amethyst. Doesn't by any means, of course, mean that this is a common gemstone. It is, as a gemstone, something which is a little bit unique and individual. We are bringing to you today that wonderful depth of your amethyst, that wonderful beauty and decadence that we have got for 11 pounds and 95 pence only. That is absolutely it. You've got 170 carats worth of these, so good luck. Let's move on to these. So we are bringing to you your base metal with your 24 carat gold plating over the top. Now, that is something really, really beautiful to be able to work with when it comes to spaces. Because not only are you going to be getting about 700 of them, but also it's actually the 24 karat gold that is against your skin. Yes. Now that is a luxury within itself, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. These, we used to, we used to have these all the time, didn't so, we? Right. we? Yeah. They weren't 24 the... carats though. No, no, they weren't. No, no. These are a different calibre, but these are amazing. Anybody that does any sort of jewelry making, it's kind of a stash essential to have your spacer beads. Mm. Like I said before, I was using the spacer beads out, out of the strand that had just been, been part of the strand. True. So having these in, in your stash ready, because you may not have enough for, for what you want to do, mm. is just an essential. It's wonderful, yeah, isn't and it? And with that amethyst, amazing. Yeah, really yeah. gives it that elevated luxury, yeah. doesn't it? If you look at somebody like, like Rachel Norris, she uses this type of thing all the time mm -hmm. and it really adds that that extra dimension yeah definitely do we know what the actual base metal is in this is it copper or brass or did not say it's a brass at the heart of it we think and then it's 24 karat gold that is against the skin now the great thing about this being brass is the strength of it in comparison to our usual copper yes. centered spaces that means for, for example, your bracelets yeah, it's, or whatever. It's, it's the, the wearability, the quality. Yes. The, yeah. And again, with all of that wonderful 24 karat gold against the skin, there is a serious usability, workability. Even if you just wanted to put these on a memory wire bracelet. Yeah. With a charm hanging down. That is a highly visible business, you know, you're, you're conversation within yeah, itself. Stretch your rings. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, just stretch your bracelets, just stack them up. Brilliant. If I'm thinking, um, on average, what seven inches and centimetres ish? Do we know? I I do I do know this, but can I remember? It's about 18 centimetres. About. So let's consider. The size of these, we're looking at about three mil. So to get a centimetre, let's say we're going to be using three of these, three, six. Yeah, that's about right, isn't it? Yeah. About three to make a centimetre. So actually, if I wanted to make a full bracelet, I probably won't have even used, you know, oh, God, that yeah, much of a yeah, tube, actually. Go so, so far. So that's going to go really far, sorry, when you consider the amount that you've got in yeah. here, 700 approximately. Therefore, this price is fabulous. 24 karat gold resting there against your skin. It's the luxury, that beautiful 24 karat buttery beauty which sits next to the skin. But, oh really? Not even 2p per bead we're That's talking about stuff. here. That's, That's great, stuff. isn't it? Because cons consider this. We always talk about how spaces make gemstones go further because yes. your gemstones are generally the most expensive part of your design. With this, though, you're getting that luxury of the 24 karat. Yeah, you're also adding, it's not just a space, skin. you're actually adding that, that 24 karat gold plating as well. So it's the, definitely the luxury that you're adding. Yeah. It is really, really wonderful. 12.95, I just think that is, for the amount of it, yes. brilliant opportunity. Could you use this in, what mediums could you use this in? 
I mean, every medium, really. I mean, in, definitely in your wire work, definitely. All them, all them little spaces where you might um, add a gizmo and maybe have to hand coil it all, you could just add these to your wire and it adds that detail so, so much quicker. Um, I mean, your macrame, your seed beading, obviously. You know, it goes right across the board, doesn't mm -hmm. it? Yeah, yeah, totally. Quite like the idea of this with Kumihimo. Beaded. Oh, yeah. Oh, Kumi, that'd look amazing. Absolutely. And you need a and lot the, yeah. for Kumihimo. Yeah. This is a lot. Yeah, yeah. Isn't it? And that's just so wonderful. Yeah. Really, it is, isn't it? I love the idea of you using, maybe even, might be a bit too much for some, but not if you did like a beady bead, maybe, of these. Yeah. Beady beads with these. Earring. Yeah. $12.95. Well done, one and all. Okay, say it again, lovely. Ooh, B Smith tote bag. I can I reach it? Of course I can. <laughs> Just give me a second. What? Let me bring to you now your beadsmith tote bag. Now, this is a brilliant bit of kit because it's <clears throat> storage. It's for traveling, it's for making on the go. I'm thinking of like commutes and stuff. It's even for the likes of, and this may well sound, you know, a bit silly, but it's even for the likes of when maybe you're making something upstairs, you know, of an evening or whatever, yeah. and then the next morning you're heading yeah. downstairs and you continue yeah, your mate. Yeah, this is the bag that I use all the time. Let me talk you around it first, just in case you've not seen it. So first things first, this is your crafter's tote. It's a brilliant for crafters for a number of reasons. Number one, it has your adjustable um, carrier on this. So if you do just wanna have it as an over the shoulder, you can have it in that way, nice and comfortable, but you can extend this out so much that it is an entire over the body I just design. Say, that is so, so strong and substantial because I carry all my tools yeah. in this bag and it, yeah, I carry it over my shoulder all the time yeah. and I've had it for years. Years and yeah. it's still going strong. Yeah. As well as that, you've also got your added handle here as well. So if you do, you know, you just grab it and you want to carry it um, close, then you absolutely can too. So already for essentially three different holding styles yeah. for your comfort. As well as that, you've got the actual goodies that are inside this. Let me show you. You've got the opening front pocket, which is a really large size. You can get your general sized uh, tablet in there without any issue whatsoever. Nice big size and it is sort of gently padded as well for the uh, whatever you pop in there's protection. On the back of this, you're getting the Velcro. Um, pocket again nice large size on there slight padding on each side as well a little bit of buffering there um, It's a really sizable piece maybe for your paperwork maybe for any of your designs your notebooks, etc. And then On the inside look at that so so much brilliant right really really sizable front pocket where you can see absolutely yes. everything you're placing in there your threading materials. For example, I'll show you these. These are some of your threading materials. Just to give you an idea of space. Set of your threading materials. Let's face it, generally, we're only going to need monofilament, tiger's tail, elastic, aren't we? There you go. And look how much space you've got left in there. Also, as well as that, you've got the pockets. Now, these pockets are fabulous because these are different sized pockets. So, you're going to have your, for example, bracelet size pockets, or if you have your seed bead tubes, etc. Three of those, as well as that, you have got your smaller, for example, ring or earring pockets, six in each, this one. Also, the fabulous thing about it is, yes. If you wanna put something large inside, then you absolutely can. Maybe you have these there for a storage. Maybe you wanna multi-purchase on these, and we have sold separately these pages yes, before. Have. You can stock up on the pages and you can make this bag hold even yeah. more. This is your bag of choice, isn't it? It is, it is, I've, and I've used it for a long time. It's fantastic. I love the fact that, you know, I can put things in that, that see-through pocket and I can grab those quickly. I, I 
take this this one's out and I have that full of findings that's that's at home mm -hmm. this one's in and I can actually fit so I've let my lesser use pliers and and things like like your bead reamers and things in all this and then I've got my my other tools in the middle there it's you know it's just so so much it's phenomenal isn't it in this. <clears throat> and I can always fit more in. it doesn't matter how much I get in I can always fit more in. And like I say, I carry it over my shoulder yeah. all the time. And that handle stayed true. As, as it should time. be. Yeah. 23 different pockets, if you will, in total on this. But you can add to that. Well done. I'm bringing you the multicolored one now. And uh, this is our jewellery maker bag. This has <clears throat> been a fan favourite. Yeah, this is the only one I haven't got. I can't believe and I, I think you're probably one. the only guest designer who has said that. We yeah. don't have many people who haven't got this. But I've got to be honest, it's one of those that when you miss it, it's gone. Yeah, I think that's the problem, yeah. This is ace. It's fabulous. Yeah. It is seriously I like the fact sturdy. I stand things up in this one. Yeah. And you've got that long section in the middle, yeah. Who was it that, uh, I'm going to guess that it was Linda. I could be wrong. Yes, it is about wine. It wasn't this bag, but Ooh, that's you could idea, put it? wine in this quite yeah. easily. You could, you could have your, your cheese and biscuits in the middle there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, all right, I yeah. love that. I reckon you could get six bottles of wine in this. Yeah. One bottle, two bottle, three bottle, four, five, six. I mean, you might, you could get two in each of them. I don't know. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Maybe this is an eight wine bottler. <laughs> yeah, apparently we've been given wine, but I missed out on the wine. Oh. It's in clothes office. Is it? Have I got some wine? Yeah. What colour are we talking? White and red. Fine by me. Yeah, fine by me. I like that. Oh, well, bring us that wine to give it a test. <laughs> we have got for you today this beautiful bag with all of these oh, added pocket. extra side pockets as well for you state's jewelry maker on it too uh, yeah part of the club there you go little pockets for your mobile phones and so much more your price point is 17 pounds and 95 pence it's brilliant isn't it, it is. it's, it's really good quality yeah. i even love the fact that it is so sturdy that is not falling on top of itself it's yeah. not like a tote bag which you know kind no. of oh, no. this it. would be great for <laughs> other crafting products like crochet and things because you can get lots of wool in there and you've got plenty of room for your crochet hooks or knitting or something like that gardening yeah sturdy enough for gardening there you can even stack a few on top of this and just to prove to you sort of the rigidity of it get the paper in that long piece there and then you yeah. can get all your yeah i'm just proving its rigidity and it's not yeah. just falling down you know what i mean I think that is really brilliant. Let me also show you, just to give you an idea of size, this is our work tablet. Plenty of room. Plenty of room in there, isn't there? Absolutely, loads and loads and loads. So if you do fancy grabbing it, now is your chance to do so. I'm moving on now to a storage solution. It is your storage case. Now, you were saying yeah, I've that you love these ones. Yeah, I've got lots of these, lots and lots of these. I absolutely love it. I think they're just phenomenal. Let me show you around them because they are multifunctional. So, <clears throat> what you've got in here is your long section here and many small pots at the side. You've got your two layered clasps here. And if I open them up, you can see all of the little um, sort of pots within here. Now, we have got different size pots here, and it doesn't really matter you on what configuration it, yeah. you put them in, um, you can kind of move them around. So for example, if I wanted to put those two smaller ones here, and then for some reason wanted to put that one there, then I absolutely could. So you can move it around. And one of the reasons you can move it around is because of the base. So if you listen to this, can you see? There's rivets at the bottom which slot perfectly into the base of this. There are also rivets in the lid, which again, sit perfectly on there. So, no escapees. No, so when this is closed mm -hmm. and all secured, it doesn't matter how many times you tip it up and up mm -hmm. and down, that everything stays in place. Mm -hmm. And let me remind you too, you can use it with the lid being a swivel lid too. Yes. We've just had it set up so that you can just take it straight off, but you don't yeah. have to. Um, it's a cool 
yeah. bit of kit, isn't it? And they all, if you multiply it, they all stack together really nicely as well. Why is that good? For yeah. anyone who's new. Just, just for storage purposes, so that you can uh, maybe pop, pop a label on the front. So so I have one with sort of all, lots of high-end gemstones, maybe strands that I've cut. Mm. So I can have full strands in the, in the long piece at the side mm. and then sort of fill in the little little pots with uh, cut strands. And little can, odds and yeah, ends. Yeah, and I can, <clears throat> I can cut the little label off um, when we get our jewellery maker. I can cut the little code number on, pop that in there as well. That's cool. And then I've got one. I've got one for pearls. I've got more than got quite a few for pearls and, and things. And they're, yeah, they're just fantastic. And I just love the fact that I can. I know I can kind of rummage through, mm. grab a tray, and think no, that's not it. And I can actually like lift it up and put it somewhere else. And I know I haven't got to kind of carry <laughs> it like this. Yeah, and, like, like gently, pop, gently. Yeah. No, no, it's they're <clears> absolutely <throat> fantastic. Because they can get cross contaminated, can't they? Yes. Especially like little seedy beads and yes, things like that. Yes, yes. It's a brilliant thing about these. And when you're working, you can say, right, I want to, I want to be working with that and that and take them out and work and everything's kind of contained and then you can just pop them straight back. Straight back. Yeah. There you go. 11 and 90. 11.45 for you. Every single pound, every single penny available for you now. So if you do want to grab it, you absolutely can. And you're going to get, I mean, I probably won't empty this out. No, I was just, yeah. but I won't empty it out because it'll take me ages to get them all back in. But I, you've got to be able to get at least half a tube of oh, these yeah, in. Easily, yeah, Even the yeah. tiny, tiny pot. Yeah. I'm going to do it. I'm doing it. Right, let's see. Because we should be able to test our theory, shouldn't we? Yeah. It's a whole oh, tube. A whole, yeah. It's a whole tube. That is fantastic. And that these are 700 size spaces of tubes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah, because that's a, these are 0 0.8. 24 carat gold plated beads, these ones are. That yeah. is a full tube in one of those pots. And you've got of the little pots one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So eight that's tube seed beads. That. But you've, those are just the tiny ones. I mean, if you've got. Two of these, yeah. you'd be able to put two tubes of these in this one. That's brilliant, isn't it? Oh, do you know what I'm thinking now? I'm thinking of making your bead soup. I'm kind of experimenting. Remind us what that is for anyone who's new. Soup is where, where you get usually the same size seed bead and uh, you mix them up and then just use them randomly. How clever was that? Oh my goodness, I have never... One. Never. I can't. You, you're right, Kerry. I can't even pick stuff up usually without dropping it. So now we but, know they're great to pour from. Yeah. Do you know what it is? It's because they've got the little lip. So yeah. the little lip literally sits on there. So you can't really go wrong with it. And I think because it goes to an angle. Oh, should we see if I can do it again? You reckon it's beginner's look? Right. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, no. I feel the pressure now. I'm using that little lip. Ah, oh, one. <laughs> one. One. But still, one and one. one only. That's incredible. Hey, oh, that's brilliant, that. Wow. Well done, absolutely every single one of you. I now yeah. have seven of them. Smiley face, says Anthony. Anthony, good on you. Yeah, well done. I think I've, I've probably got, I think I've got eight or nine of them, yeah. Oh, all right. Yeah. One up and shit. Sorry. You better get yourself another, Anthony. <laughs> yeah, I think that is real. I'm like, oh. Because uh, even if you haven't got anything to put in it now, it's that sort of thing. We don't have them on that often, no, so right. yeah, grab them while you can. Let's get ready for the snap ability. Oh, that's a good snap. Yeah. Oh, that's that is a satisfying snap. Yeah, yeah. Strong, sturdy. Strong, secure. sturdy. If that were a biscuit, Ooh. it'd be a brandy snap. It would. Wouldn't it? It would. Would. Or a ginger. Ooh, a ginger nut. Oh. Um, well done, everyone, on that. My choice, what a treat! I have got, oh darn, that is exactly what I was going to pick, but I've been told not to. Uh, okay then, let's go, a little bit unusual, let's go for 16. Oh, oh. <gasps> wow, look at that colour. Isn't that wow. incredible? Iolite. Yes. Now, what I love about this Iolite is how... The colour itself is almost kyanite strength. Yes. Which often, I like, can be a little bit... There's some real intensity of colour in those. Yeah. Sometimes I like can be a little bit murky. Yes. This most certainly is not. <sighs> Look at that. 
Isn't that sensational? I love the way, and just look at that shape. Oh my gosh, against the skin. Oh. That is London blue topaz yes. colour. Yeah. London blue obviously has been treated to be that way. Generally, more often than not, it's irradiated to be that colour. This is natural. This is the most dynamic eye light I have seen this year, without a shadow of a doubt. No questions, no quibbles. Most dynamic. That is phenomenal. Not murky, not deep, not dark, intense. A London blue or kyanite-like colour in a stone that we tend to not see it. And the fact of the matter is, you're getting a lot of transparency with this. So the light's able to transcend through. When you get that light transcending through, it means that you get that opportunity where the gemstone for all intensive purpose changes colour before your eyes because of the direction of the light that travels through it. So I like when it's got clarity, not all iron light will do this, when it's got clarity, that's what it's doing. If you look at it in one direction, it's this beautiful denim blue, but with sunlight, and remember it's, it is mainly in sunlight, if the sunlight strikes this at a different axis, it goes almost like a antique bronze color and it does appear to change color before your eyes. It's only gonna work when you've got lovely transparent pieces and that is exactly what this strand is. A beautiful, bountiful strand, which let's be honest, even changes character between on a white background, like a nice white blouse or against the skin. I mean, that looks like a whole different kettle yeah. of fish, doesn't it? Amazing. I like the shape wow. of these as well. I'd be tempted to, to use them and maybe make some flowers out of them. So they're kind of sat on the flat. Mm. Lovely and idea. Some of the petals are like little forget-me-not flowers, something like that. Really That's pretty. That's gorgeous, perfect color for that yeah. as well. I've never seen an eye like quite like this before. It's a real standout strand for me and we're bringing it to you. Can we? Okay. All right. We're about to bring you best ever deal. Best ever deal is about to come in on this one right now. Best ever. Never been that low, never wow. been anywhere near that price. It's been on air at $14.95 before, $16.95. It's been on the web app for a couple of weeks now. $9.95, lowest ever deal. That is impeccable for this quality, for that beauty. Let's face it, you know, how many times do we see eye light at the best of times? Yeah, yeah, but yeah, how many times quality. do you see it with clarity yeah, like this? Yeah, I mean, just um, cascaded in some earrings. I'm wow. absolutely amazed. So all that light catches it at the different angles and look absolutely stunning. That is just going to be next level, isn't it? Yes. We have got beauty, we have got intrigue, we have got interest. It is only nine pounds and 95 men. I think that is sensational. This is the kit coming up in a bit. Mmm, mmm. Opal. And you've got some morganite hues and you've got um, aquamarine hues in that one as well. Really pretty, very unusual. It's coming up for you in a little bit. £9.95 for you. Uh, more black spinel for you now. I did some in the kit earlier on. Oh, oh, these are substantial. Oh, look at the cuts. Yay! I love this one. It's a double sided. It's a double sider. Okay, this is really, really cool. I think anyway, to reversible jewelry. So let's um, let's think of something traditional. Let's think Dalton Abbey. Oh. Let's think the sort of decadence and just general all-round oh, elegance yeah. of that kind of jewelry. And let's keep it traditional. Let's keep our facets on this side, very much mirroring the girdle of the stone. The girdle of the stone being the largest part of the stone, and then we are faceting in towards what you may imagine to be the table. Beautiful, traditional, elegant sparkle. And now, let's go modern at the flip of a strand. <laughs> Completely different facet now. You've got that almost elongated, sort of shard-like culé, if you will. And then you've got these leaf-like facets which go towards it, almost like veins centering on that main stem. Every single one of these now has got punch, it's got impact, it's bright, it's bold, it's a double-sided stone. Cut two different ways on each and every single stone. This is reversible jewelry to be created with. This is reversible jewelry to be enjoyed. This is two looks 
in one. 32.95. This is the first time I've seen one that's been cut like this. This is amazing. Cool, isn't it? Isn't it? Really so let's cool. say, let's say that is gonna be what 16 pounds per side? Because this is two whole different pieces of jewellery. Yeah. That's great. Two necklaces, 16 each, that's essentially. Amazing, well no, it? it's a bit more than that, isn't it? Danny, what is it properly, Poppy? Grab your abacus out. Uh 32.95 divided by two. 1650 1650 1650 for it so about 1650 per necklace so this would be my uh, do you know what this would be my um you know where it at work going out yeah. for meetings afternoon tea. yeah afternoon tea don't mind if i do and then this side would be oh should we go for drinks after work don't yeah. mind if i do flippity doo dah yeah there you wow. go, record, low deal, best deal ever, 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 £14.95, that's not £16.50 per necklace, if you will, because £16.50 per side, now £7.50 per side, per look, per drama, that's incredible, no? That is fantastic, isn't it? Brilliant, isn't the it? The earrings are going to look amazing. So you, it's going to look like a totally different pair of earrings from behind, isn't it? And let's be totally honest, it's not a subtle change. No, it's dramatic. It's got that drama, hasn't it? Yeah, it really does. This is P-A-R-T, why not? Oh, yes. This is cucumber sandwiches. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's different, isn't it? It's more subtle, it's more subdued. Yes. It's incredible, that, isn't it? Don't you think? With the gold spaces, maybe? Oh, yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. Yeah. Look at that. Or even, if you want to go a little bit genteel. Oh, yeah. Yeah? Very nice. Not totally afraid of it either with that amethyst I did before. Black and purple. No, goes alternate nicely, drops, doesn't it? maybe. Mm. Yeah, that'd work quite well, yeah. wouldn't it? 14 pounds and 95 pence. What a corker of a strand that is. If you fancy it, you know what to do. 0800 644 655. If you want to get your hands on it today, uh, press option number one and you will get the opportunity to speak to a real person. None of this robotic stuff. None of this, um, please place your order. I would like the spinel. Oh Did you say cubic zirconia? <laughs> no, spinel. Did you say labradorite? Do you know what I mean? None of that humans. People. Humans. Nice people. Lovely yeah, people. They are dead knowledgeable as well. A lot of them are trained by the GIA. They're only a few doors down. In fact, do you remember our old studio? The old where we used to be filmed, down down in the other place that we used to be filmed. That's where the call centre is. In that room. Yes, I know. Well I never. Right, what am I bringing? Pop it chops. Onyx. Ooh, look at them. <gasps> what that shape. I love this shape, it's cool in it. I'm thinking Studs. with the spinel we had earlier. Alternating from your... those the, from the first kit. Yes, that's alternating exactly. Alternating that, the directions. That'd look amazing. Because if you don't remember the spinel from earlier on, same shape but drilled at a different point. Yeah. That'd be really cool. Yeah, I'd love to see that together. Yeah. Black and green, kind of a little bit Wizard of Oz. Anyway. Yeah, I was thinking wicked. Yeah. Yes! Yeah. Goodness, that is yes. kind of what I was thinking. Yeah. yeah, wicked. Yeah, totally. We have got for you here 95 carats worth. Apart from, you know, its beautiful colour, the shape is obviously what is taking our mind. What is good for a designer about different shapes? Different shape, it just gives you, it just widens the range of, of what you can do with something. So with this being being drilled sort of through that centre and then we've got them elongated points at each side, I'd be thinking maybe a pendant drop so that we've got it kind of laddering down mm -hmm. and then maybe earrings, something like that, and popping things next to it. Just experiment with what, whatever you've got in your stash at mm -hmm. home. Just definitely, you're, I would say, if anybody's got a, what is it called, a rep, rep, 
can't think, res resolution? That's it. Yeah, New Year's yeah. resolution. Next year's resolution, get as many different shapes as you can. Oh, that's and a cool one. That's a really good, yeah. That's a yeah. really good the jewelry one. jewelry makers, New Year's resolution. And if that is your idea, <laughs> then um, I've got some dog tooth amethyst tomorrow yeah. in the 8 a.m. hour, which are really unique long pieces. Yeah. Re resolution. Yeah. Move out of your comfort zone yeah. and get some different shapes in your stash and you'll be amazed at what you come up with. Just, just play around with things, yeah. We are bringing to you 95 carats worth. Ox, are you 87? Is your code on this today? £19.95 for you today with this strand. And there are plenty on there. Shall we take £5 off? Oh, yeah. Do Don't. It. Mind if we do. £14.95 pence today. If you fancy graphing it, I think this is going to, as you've said, add real uniqueness, add real difference. Do you mind if I lend? Yeah. I quite like the idea of them. Yeah, the glow that, the glow that they've got together. Yeah, mm. they, and they are both absolutely yes. glowing, aren't they? Yeah. They're gleaming. So something like that onto, you know, a design like this. Oh, wow. A beautiful set of colours there. Really pretty. In fact, let's let's see. Speaking of shapes. Oh, with the rose quartz. Unusual shapes, yes. too. We'll be talking about these very soon. I love them. Uh, part of the kit they are. They'll be on their way. £14.95. Let me bring. This is the largest aquamarine cab I've ever seen us bring. Wow. Oh, look at that color. Lovely rambunctious oh. color, lovely depth, lovely um, sort of archetypal, if I'm honest. There's something beautiful about an archetypal color of aquamarine. It goes to show that you've got quality. Nine carats, wow. A full-fledged nine-carat piece. That is gargantuan for this stone. When we talk about aquamarine of this kind of quality, you know, nine carats isn't something that generally crosses our no. mind, is it? No, not at all. Maybe for a strand. Yeah, a whole strand. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. nine carats in one piece is, is phenomenal. I mean, your gallery wire with this, it, oh. it, it would just set perfectly. Yeah. But equally, you could prong set it with your sterling silver wire. I, wouldn't def I would definitely wouldn't go lower than sterling silver. Definitely and why is that? You. It just deserves a, a really good precious metal and sterling yeah. silver or, or anything above that would be perfect mm. for it. I mean, set into your silver clay would look amazing. Yeah, incredible yeah. idea. Yeah. Just having a little look online and remember, Aquamarine is a member of the Beryl family. This is a totally natural variety. Um, I've literally just typed in Aquamarine gemstones, five carats. And the pieces that are coming up are the likes of um, uh, Aspals of London, the likes of, uh, that's another one, there's another one, Fenton and Co. But the price is literally on five carat pieces, so they'll be around that mark, range between £1,900 set into a ring, and the one that is a few down from it is £2,950,000 in a ring. And I'm not saying that they're like for like, because they're not, this isn't in a ring for starters, but... As an idea, carrot weight is king when it comes to aquamarines. You have got something that even if you don't make jewellery yet, and remember, you know, if you don't make jewellery yet, if you make an order with us today, at this moment in time as it stands, we have an offer running whereby you'll get two genuine gemstone strands for free. And also, sorry, Dan had a little fall then. Well, a little, you, you nearly fell over your chair, didn't you, Dan? Yeah. You were all right, love? Yes, thank you. It was hilarious. Uh, especially as the fact you're clear. Yeah. yeah, it's fine. Yeah, it's especially fine. as the fact you're cleaning your glasses at the yeah. same time. Uh, but yeah, um, we are uh, giving you two free genuine gemstone strands and a DVD to help you learn to make jewellery. And obviously we do all the on-air deals as well and, and demonstrations. But uh, the great thing with this, I think anyway, is the fact that even if you don't make jewellery, that, as it comes, with the viewing box, is a talking point. Yeah, again, just a collector's piece. Just to have a piece of the nine carat aquamarine is just amazing. It's an elite, isn't it? Yes, yes. An elite size for a high-end gem. It is a luxury, it is high-end gem. And the fact of the matter is, 
we have got some serious goodies, some serious treats, some real, real, real one-off chances for you here at Jewelry Maker, and we're about to prove that now. Your price for a fully fledged nine wow. carats is just twenty nine ninety five. If I show that to you as if oh, it were a ring that. size, I mean that is cocktail ring standard. That is real decadence, isn't it? That's amazing. To get that depth of colour as well, that's amazing. To be able to say that I could have a pendant of aquamarine, that's exactly what this is, isn't it? Yeah. Don't forget it's a birthstone as well, so great for your for your gifts and for your treats, isn't it? And let me also remind you too that, you know, if you love these kind of colors in a kit, which does have a demonstration coming up shortly after the break, great pairing. Yes, absolutely. That is a big, bold look, isn't it? Yes. Really, it is very <laughs> eye-catching. I love those together. We have got $29.95 on that one for you today. So I wish you all luck. After the break, I've got some more goodies. Anyone fancy five meters of chain? Because I've got that coming up for you after the break. You are gonna love it, it's a really beautiful chain. As well as that, kits. I've got two kits, very, very different styles, very different designs. This one's coming up. And I've got the um, candy floss kit as well. So, if you want chain and kits and inspiration, don't go anywhere. We'll be back in about three and a half minutes. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. If you have a question or a query for Jewelry Maker, then you can contact our call centre on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Or alternatively, you can email help at jewelrymaker.com. You can watch our Jewelry Maker show every day on our website by clicking the Watch and Buy Online link in the top right hand corner of our homepage. Are you new to Jewelry Maker? Shop with us for the first time and you'll receive a free gift. The free gift includes two beautiful gemstone strands in an organza bag, plus a DVD ideal for jewelry making newbies, featuring tutorials essential for getting started and so much more. As long as you qualify as a new customer and haven't shopped with us before, then your free gift will automatically be added to your order when you make your first purchase with us. It's really that simple. Gemstone strands are selected at random, so gemstone size, shape and colour will vary for each new customer. Why stop there? Once you receive your new free gift, we'd love to see what you create. Share your designs with us via our Facebook page and join our creative community of jewellery makers. Start your jewellery making journey with us today. Create. Wear. Share. Our Jewelry Maker community is a fantastic platform to share, learn, chat and make new friends. So why not like our Facebook page and join over 64,000 like-minded people.
don't even know what that is. Just happened that, yeah. didn't it? <laughs> Lovely and warm, you. Thank you. Lovely. Hello, welcome back to the final hour doop of today's shows. Don't worry though, still loads to come. And in fact, uh, Saturday and Sunday, you're in for some serious treats. I'll tell you more about that in a bit. Before it though, I am about to bring to you the treasure upon all treasures. That if you are watching on the repeat, you have got the final 50 minutes or so to get your hands on it at a deal of the day price. If you're watching a live on air and you've been at work all day, this is the first time you've been able to see it. What I'm about to bring to you, which, <laughs> sorry, which, sorry, that was so loud. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> which it's, uh, which I'm just waiting to be handed, but um, Chris is currently draping himself in. Is solid <laughs> silver chain. This is one continual five meters. Body chains, perfect. Earrings, incredible. Necklaces, sensational. Wrap around designs. This is something yes. above yeah. and beyond, yeah. isn't it? It's going to give you that ability to just use oodles of chain. Mm. <laughs> I'm so glad that you did not pull that anymore. Chris just got it stuck in his earring and was like, what's that stuck on? And just, oh, so close to an earring and a spliced earlobe. Um, I am ringing to you now the solid sterling silver chain, a full five meters worth of your Italian design Rolo chain. When we talk about Italian chain, we talk about that history, aren't we? Yes, yeah, the quality, the, the, the way that it's, it's machined, it's amazing, isn't it? Yeah. It's quality, it's luxury, it's high-end beauty. And the fact of the matter is, we have got Solid 95 sterling silver in that Rolo chain. You can see here the fact that the, why, one of the reasons the Rolo chain is so good, and um, it is literally link into link into link. They're all the same, they're all equal, yeah. they're all aperture points in essence. Yeah, aren't it they? gives it that, that ultimate strength, doesn't it? Really, it does. We are bringing to you 95 solid sterling silver, and I have got for you an incredible one-off deal of the day opportunity. I will just let you know that this is not a start price. Obviously we did a start price and then we dropped it down to the deal of the day. Today, and let me just remind, this is nine and a half grammers for 39 pounds and 95 pence only. That is about two grams a meter. And also, it is about, it is about, um, what did you say per meter? Um, eight. 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 Yeah. Per meter. Eight pounds per meter. Look at that. That's gorgeous, isn't it? Look at the way it sort of moves yeah. and flows. Yeah, the way this flows, especially, I mean, if you were to make those kind of tassels out of, out of sterling silver chain, absolutely amazing. £39.95. I'm sorry, I don't know what's happened to my team this hour. Danny's doing ridiculous jokes. If you saw the camera shudder then, it's because uh, Dan dropped his uh, tuck biscuit on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> My wonderful floor manager nearly chopped his lobe in half. <laughs> Blimey, it's all going on. I have got for you £39.95. Love this. Love the opportunity here. 
And, you know, there's so much you can do with things like this, as we've said. And if you're looking at it, and just give you a heads up, if you are brand new, normally what we'll say with this is, for example, you as a jump ring into a clasp. Yeah. But, obviously, with this chain, I'm not going to say that. That jump ring isn't going to no, get through the loops. Yeah. So what I will say is use an end with a sterling silver crimp tube to crimp those down. That there is a loop of sterling silver chain that you can now attach. So imagine that's a crimp there. And that then means you can now attach your jump ring, for example. So really easy still to use. Well done all. Great deal there for you. Place that back there. Um, okay, let's dive on in now to the kits. And as I said before, it's great because you've been given four kits, but they're four really different kits. Yeah. It's not four kits that complete a kit. No. It's almost like you've had two shows worth of work. <laughs> a little bit, but it was lots of fun. That's always yeah. a good thing. It's always good. So what we're going to bring to you first is, which one is it first? Sorry, I did say candy floss. This kit, I think, is perfect for beginners. If you are brand new, you've never made jewelry in your wildest dreams, let me just remind you, and even if you've never done shopping telly before, because let's face it, it's, it's you know, a world whereby I think some of us get caught up buying online, but there's a lot of TV shows at the moment, isn't there, about trying not to shop online um, and shopping on your local high street yeah. and shopping with, mm -hmm. um, you know, sort of uh, businesses in the UK, etc. The fact of the matter is that when you're shopping on shopping TV, it can be a little bit daunting. But let me just remind you of something real quick. If you've never shot with shopping TV before, shopping TV is kind of governed by absolutely oodles of different organisations. So we are looked at by, um, you know, gemstone um sort of organizations obviously the likes of Ofcom we are looked at by people um who are looking at the way in which we sell things and openness and honesty people who are looking at kind of our returns and, and all of the housekeeping stuff all of this work all of these people are watching us so it's a really really safe and secure way to purchase and the great thing about it is you can do it from your sofa yes. do it from your sofa if you are brand spanking new as well today and you sat there on your sofa and you're thinking, do you know what, for the Crimbo Limbo in between Christmas and New Year, I do fancy trying maybe a new hobby, learning a new skill, doing something with the kids or whatever. This is a brilliant kit to start off with because you've got the threading materials that you need. You've also got two strands and with your first order, you get two free genuine gemstone strands and a DVD, which will show you exactly how to use the likes of your elastic, your beaded thread and your monofilament. So really it's all there in one purchase, easy yeah. to do. And if you think, okay, that's pretty cool. I'm intrigued <coughs> with that. Check out the jewelry because you have made really exceptional pieces of jewelry with this kit. Thank you. Tell us what you liked about this kit. Uh, it's got, it's, I mean, it's got aquamarine in it. So, you know, what's not to like really? <laughs> Yeah, it, and it was just a great a great kit for, like you say, beginners. I mean, especially if you wanted to move on to a more advanced, you've got them different shapes as well to play with. Mm -hmm. But great for learning your threading, learning things like using your spacers. So I've used the spacers from, from the, other, the other strand. Using your crimps, you know, just really basic, get down to making jewellery kind of kits. Yeah. yeah. And what I love about this, when you're looking at it, and you were mentioning the aquamarine, 80 carats worth yes. on that diamond cut, which is an unusual shape to see. Basically, the diamond cut describes a diamond table, essentially. With that look, juxtaposing that with the 60 carats, 6 mil rose quartz, although it's pink and blue, which technically on the colour wheel don't, you know, you know sit across yeah. from each other or anything... Mm -hmm. It's the tone of these which pulls them in together. Yeah, yeah, that, 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 that pastel toning, that's mm. absolutely beautiful. Yeah. I think it's such a gorgeous kit. Where would you imagine someone wearing your suite of jewellery? I think it's kind of everyday jewellery. You know, you could wear, sort of just go out shopping or something. But again, like that, that afternoon tea, sort of, that you're a bit dressed up. You've got your gemstones on, haven't you? Yeah. Mm. I love in the bracelet how you've created this design to really highlight each and every yeah. single one of these. We are bringing to you 80 carats worth today of uh, the aquamarine, don't forget. 60 carats worth of the rose quartz 
and wait for this, serious amounts of thread. 80, is it 80 or 70? 80, no. 80 <laughs> meters <laughs> of your money filament. It is 80 meters of your money filament, which is, uh, goes on for ages and ages and ages. Then you're getting six meters of your elastic. Six meters for sure. And finally, of your 0.38 approx uh, beading thread, 50 meters. 50. So 50 plus 80 plus 6. You've got a lot of threaded material going on there, haven't you? Got a lot. We are bringing to you your candy floss collection. When you consider you have made uh, one, two, three, hang on. One, two, three, four, five. Is that about five or six pieces of jewelry you've made that you contain this? Five, six. Six, six pieces of jewellery at that price point already. Great deal. And it's quite gem heavy with them all as well. Yeah. yeah. But actually today, we're rolling it down. You ready for this? You would probably expect to spend more than that on the aquamarine yeah, alone. Definitely, definitely. It's such a you unique, cut. unique cut. Yeah, definitely. Just for that cut, just to get something a little bit more unusual. It's okay. such a unique cut, it's such a strength of beauty and it goes great with that rose quartz which again is in these sort of wonderfully dynamic angular um, bicones which we don't see as often yeah. as we once used to. I think that is a sensational deal. I mean, you know, even if you just considered, uh, if you were to make one of these items and sell one of these pieces yes. on, give us your roundabout price that you personally yeah. as so, a designer would sell. So the stretchy, the stretchy bracelet which is the one at, at the far end. Uh, that's just onto your, your elastic. Which you get in it's the kit. It's got one aquamarine, the rest of it is rose quartz. I would be send, selling that for around about £15. Just, just for one. Perfect. Just for one. Yeah. It's incredible that, isn't it? Isn't that just wonderful? So this is it, your Candy Floss collection. If you fancy it, do seize the moment. Real varied now with this. Tell us a little bit about this collection, please. This this is really interesting because you've got all those different shapes and the nugget trend at the moment is huge. huge. Absolutely huge. Anything that you can put the words yeah. raw or natural, yeah. you know, organic, the rough nuggets is absolutely fantastic. It's so, everywhere yeah. at the moment. Yeah. And then we've Big got names. some big name gemstones in there as yeah. well. Absolutely beautiful, beautiful gemstones. So what I'm bringing to you in here is varied. We have got for you Morganite in here. I have also got Ethiopian Opal and I'm bringing to you Aquamarine. Let me give you the stats on that strand. these are all strand. substantial pieces of, of these gemstones as well. They're not tiny. Yeah, 10 by seven to 18 by 10. Yes. Now that is dramatic for any gemstone actually, let alone an Opal or an Aquamarine. That's incredible. I have got for you top drilled here and Boy, those opal are sensational. Now the opal you might want to expect to be completely and absolutely clean, but actually what you've got here is you've got them essentially taken from the raw form and then they haven't been kind of cobbed within an inch of their life, which again plays into that trend right now. Yes. And you really get to see the colours. Yeah, you want to be able to see that, those internal colours with colours within, but also see that little bit of maybe a bit of host rock and, and that you know, just to get that on-trend look. Yeah, you've yeah. got one here that with one, the host yeah. rock, haven't you? That's amazing. So if we go around to the, mm -hmm. the opposite, it's like you can see right inside there. Is it coming across? Yeah. It's always hard with these, yeah. but you can. You get an idea, yeah. don't you? That one just jumps <laughs> straight out on, me on, on my strand that I've got here. It's wonderful. You get to see how beautiful and unique it is. We're going to do price of the strand, get the findings for free today. And you do get the findings, which again, if you are new, you are going to need because apart from stretchy bracelets, uh, for example, or beading thread with macrame, you're probably going to want a clasp or a yeah. chain or earring findings, for example. So today, crystal nugs. 80 carats worth on that strand with the findings should be just shy of 58 pounds today for you. 
1995. Today wow. isn't that incredible? That is, and for the amount that you've got on there, the amount of aquamarine, that beautiful morganite, absolutely stunning. One of the best price drops on the kit for the entire day. That is magnificent, isn't it? Absolutely, mate. Look at the look at the colour in this. It's amazing. I can't believe the price of that at all. <laughs> it's just astonishing yes. should have been just shy of 58 pounds live on air though 19.95 if you're watching on the repeat let me say to you first off um in about 45 minutes that morning show will be starting whereby we have dog tooth amethyst for you with the lovely debrudge and so much more also to let you know that in 45 minutes this will go back up to that original price which is just shy of £58, 19.95 if you check it out now, so do seize that moment, because you should pay quite a considerable amount more for the strands alone, so good luck to every single one of you on that. Let's get crafting, shall we? And we're going to work with these nuggets, aren't yeah, we? Yeah, we're going to work with these nuggets. So, so you do get the findings, so we're going to be using the earring findings with that. Fine. We're going to be using the crimp beads as well. But sometimes when we when you look at these kind of strands and, and you kind of take into consideration, oh, I might want to make a pair of earrings. And then you look at the findings that we've got and you think, oh, that's not going to work because they're going to sit out to the side. Oh, yeah, of course. They're going to go through. That's so I point. thought we'd work with the, the beading thread from the, the other kits and show you how to how to set the, the earrings and using these nuggets in, in that earring form. And I think that gives it their best look because to see it in the ears, especially the Ethiopian, you know, well, all of them really, mm -hmm. it, you can see all the way around the gemstone and get the best from it. Absolutely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Okay, so so I've chosen, I'm going to make the pair of earrings that are in the middle there, I believe. So I've got the opal ones on there. And Why did you opt for the opal in those ones? Uh, just, it's mainly because of the shape of these mm. two, because because they've kind of got this point at the top. So go for the, for this design, definitely go for the ones that have got kind of the point at, at the top rather than the ones that are cut flat mm, at the top. It. But it, it's it's your own preference. You can, you can go around and, and see see how it works for you. So I've got one of the Morganites on just a short piece of uh, beading thread. It's it's far longer than I actually need, but um, we're going to be threading through, so, so we need a little bit to work with. So I've got that, that through there, and it goes very, very easily. You can see it, it moves very, very easily through mm. there, so you've got no problems getting it threaded on. Okay, so... On each side, I'm going to use, I'm actually using the spacers that came on the strand. So I'm popping a round spacer and then one of these kind of bugle shaped beads spacer and then another one on one side. And then the same again on the other side. So around one of the bugle beads and the round okay so i've got those beads on each side so and then what you'll see is if we bring those together they'll form kind of a nice shape around around the points of that that gemstone and Can then I just ask, what about if the tip is a bit longer, or were they all quite similar? They size? were all quite similar, but um, let's have a look. So, so this one's a little bit more flat across the top. Mm. So what I would do is probably add a couple of the rounds and then the bugle, mm -hmm. just so that you can kind of form it and shape it around the gemstone. But you've got plenty of time to play around with it. And I did find I used these spacers all the way through this kit. Mm. Well, both kits. Mm. There was loads and loads of spaces. So That's definitely good. don't don't throw anything away. Way. Okay, so once we've got that, so we've got it even on each side, I'm going to pop two pieces, the two pieces of beading threads through one of those beads, which okay. is plenty of room in there. Okay, I'm just going to pop my glasses on because I forgot to put them on. I love these ones. Yep. Okay, so, so we've got them in and what you'll find is it'll do this and it'll try and bounce back. Okay, but don't worry about that. And then on top of that single bead, we're going to pop on one of our crimp beads. Now, crimp bead is a tube that we use, use to kind of bind things together. Okay, so we're popping that all the way through. And then what we're going to do is I'm just going to use a pair of round nose pliers just to create that loop on the top. So it's just a matter of kind of jiggling this around a little bit. Just to kind of get everything so it sat's really nice. 
Okay, and then you want to hold that in place and then bring, bring that back through all those beads. So I've come back through the crimp bead and that single bead, okay? And then bringing these all the way through, so grabbing Okay, so you want to bring this down so you've got your loop in, in place. You need to just make sure they've not crossed over. These have crossed over a little bit, so I'm just going to um, manoeuvre them a little bit. Okay. And then pull it down so, because we want our loop to be even on both sides. So we've got that loop in there. Okay, so that's the part that's going to attach to our our earring finding. And then, shall I use your pair? Do you mind talking yeah. us through these? Yeah, so let's... Because we're going to bring so these on air now. Great for beginners, yeah. if you've not got so, them yet. So, I don't know, can you see through there? Dan might be yeah. able to see it. Yeah. So, if we can if we can look through there. So, the one, the little... Um, that, there we go. So, the part that's got the, the little kind of kidney bean, that's the one that we use first. Mm -hmm. Okay? So, what that's going to do, if I just open that a little bit and then squash it, that's going to form our little tube into that shape. So it's going to form that indentation in the middle of it. Mm -hmm. And then what we're going to do is we're going to swap and move on to this bottom one here. And then that's going to form it back into a round. So it's going to kind of fold it in on itself. Got okay. You. So I don't, are you going to be able to see it against my top? There. Right. So in this one, I'm going to use that top one first and give that a squish. How much pressure are you putting on there? So quite a bit of pressure. Yeah, it's, I know, giving it a good, a, a good squish. Okay. Now, if I turn that to camera two, can you see there's like that little indentation in there? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn that on its side and then use, using the more rounded part of this. Mm -hmm. So there, I'm going to just give that a squish back again. Mm -hmm. And what that will do is actually just kind of reshape it into a round. Yeah, so nice yeah. and smooth against the skin. Yeah, yeah. So I'm just going to pick mine up because uh, that's it. There we go. So, and then you've got that round at the top, mm -hmm. ready to, to hang straight onto your earring hook. Fabulous. Six ninety five, dollars by the way, on those pliers. Snip this off and your earring is ready to go. Okay. Love those drops. Okay, and you can just pop them, put your earring up, hook straight on there. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you do get the earring hooks, remember? Yeah, yeah. So, and all you would do, just you, all you need to do is just open that up and pop your earring wire on there and then close up. Yep, yeah, so you're ready to go. Look at that. Beautiful. Okay. Isn't that frab? Yeah. Gorgeous, gorgeous Morganite. Thank you so, so, so much for showing us that demonstration. And as you can see, that kit alongside the other, or oh, standalone, yeah. goes away It's a nice way to, to know how to use your nuggets as well, just to, to get that shape. And because they've got that point on the top, they get a nice drop. So true. Yeah. Grab it whilst you can. If you are brand new to us, you're going to want a toolkit. Let's face it. Yeah. Now... Just to let you know, these are not only for beginners, these are your micro fine four piece plier sets. I've literally got less than 10 of these available. It's a mustard toolkit, isn't it? Yes. And the fact that these are micro fine means oh, your jewelry goes oh, to the next the level. As well. <laughs> so these are absolutely micro fine. You get loads in here, including round nose pliers, chain nose pliers, bent nose pliers, in fact, sorry, flat nose pliers and chain nose pliers. Oh, they are amazing. They're really super fine, aren't oh, they? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mega, 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 super duper fine. And I love how fine the, the round nose pliers go to as well, that, that really fine tip. Yeah. Look at those ones for jump rings and stuff. Yes. You know, jump rings, you've got that lovely yeah. size there to hold them. Promise you on this, if you are brand new, because the fact of the matter is when you start off on a new medium, you don't necessarily know so, what you're yeah. going to need. So you're you are going to need spirals. Tools. Less than five. Yeah, your spirals are great for your... your you bent those pliers because you've got yes. kind of got that angle to pull around yeah great point 
Less than five available now. Your micro fine set, only $24.95. Feel them as well. Yeah. They feel yeah. lovely. Yeah. They have sold out. Yeah. $24.95. Great Good luck. quality oh. brand as well. Yeah, well done yeah. for everyone who got them. Well, well done. done. Okay, I'm moving on to... Let me bring you the display stands now. I think these are just fabulous. These are great for your craft fairs. These are great even just for your bedside table. Now the fantastic thing about these are that they are for bracelets, <coughs> necklaces, earrings, and you also get a ring attachment as well. Now, the incredible thing with this is if you want to make this match your bedroom, for example, you can use the paint that you've got on your walls on this, it's gonna match up perfectly. Or if you're into your decoupage, you could decoupage this to be whatever look, design, you fancy getting your hands Ooh, on. Maybe you, you wanna use- it reversible as well. Of course you can, yeah. yeah. Yeah, great point. And the wonderful thing with this, as you can see when it's set up, is that it is changeable, so. I want to take this large design off for some reason. I want to switch it with, with one of these or I'll just want that maybe to sit somewhere else. I can do that. Also, if I am going to a craft fair, I have got a serious amount of jewellery on these that then stacks away. Yes. Very, very small. That is an easy handheld yeah, size. you trying to fit all those busts bust into. Yeah, the 3D into ones, for example. Yeah. And in fact, and I did a test on this the other day, the thickness of one of those, of that whole set, is actually takes up less space than one of our generic, yes. you know, busts that we bring to you. Also, the great thing is, you know, it holds a lot of jewellery. So this one here will hold numerous bracelets. You get the ring stand as well, which for some reason I can't see in here. Um, but yeah, you get all of these different sizes. You can get a necklace on every single one of these if you so wish. You can see how easy it is to set up as well, which is brilliant, isn't it? If I just move them backwards. It's dead easy to set up. You literally just find the area, slot them into place, and there you go, shimmy it around. And there you go, you're ready and raring to go. And you can use them in whatever way you wish. Each one of them has a slightly smoother side and a slightly grainier side. So depending on what craft you want to do, you might want to switch those around. And each one can obviously hold a multitude of different lengths of necklaces, set of earrings, and maybe even a set of earrings here if you wanted, yeah. or a bracelet through here to match. So a full suite of jewelry to say the least. Your price point, 49.95 usually. But today, for you to put your own creative creativity on, your own branding on, remember? Because yeah. if you want, you know, to take yeah, a photo definitely. on this. Your own branding would look amazing, mm. wouldn't it, on that? Mm. And that it'd really set you apart from everybody, everybody else's totally. stall. £24.95. pence. Yeah, if you wanted to be set apart. And the other thing, and I actually did this the other day. I was, in a, I was at the uh, Christmas Market in Liverpool, and there was a... Faulty camper stand, and I was walking past, and there was a big queue of people, so I was finding it dead hard to take a picture. But I took a sneaky picture, and it was a bit blurry. So, anyway, I was taking sneaky pictures. People do it at craft fairs. I have seen it with my own yeah, eyes. I have is. done craft fairs and looked at people who were like walking around with the phone like this, and I'm thinking, you're taking a picture of them, yeah. you're going to be sending them to someone. I know, you know, I'm not daft, I don't mind. But if you've got your branding on this, yes. and people are casually taking a picture, then every single photo that is taken... Yeah, every time that's shared, they're sharing your branding yeah, as well. Yeah, literally. Yeah. Not just, wow, look at this necklace, yeah. you know. Do you think mum would like this for Christmas or whatever? None yeah. of that. Your branding all over it as well. £24.95 for you today. We're going to bring to you a little bit of a spectacular now. Um, let me just remind you that... When we have a one locational gemstone, there's always a level of scarcity to it. But I would say maybe none more so in the last few years anyway than the one found at the foothills of Mount Kilimanjaro. Now, this stone was taken on when it was originally found by Manuel de Souza um, by Tiffany. Um, he actually didn't send his pieces off to Tiffany first. He sent them off uh, to the Smithsonian first, but he himself took them to... Um, Tiffany and they launched a campaign about this one locational gemstone and in that campaign they said you can only find Tanzanite in two places in the world in Tanzania and in Tiffany and they spent a lot of money promoting this gemstone and they sold like hotcakes 
Because of that, obviously popularity and demand um, was rising, therefore supply was declining. And we've been used to this for a while now. It was it was once called, uh, you know, the one generation of stone being described as a thousand times rarer than diamond. We're actually at a situation now where that has passed us by and gone. A thousand times rarer than diamond, so much rarer than that now. It's a special strand. It's Tanzanite. It's your star by. In sort of the end of July this year, 2019, something kind of took us by surprise. Um, and what kind of shocked us was sort of in June, well, in September last year, um, a wall was built around the main mining location um, um, of, of Tanzania uh, to prevent poachers, um, amongst other things. And um, around about April, I would say, this year, we heard that for the first time, you know, um, Tanzanite had had escalated its profits dramatically because there weren't as many people, you know, illegally getting their hands on this stone. And it looked like it was all up and up and up. And then at the end of July, we got told that the biggest provider of Tanzanite, who owned the biggest plot of land, had closed. Tanzanite One has closed their mine. It is absolutely done. This is not being taken out of the ground in that area anymore. The prices have escalated dramatically. And what we are being offered, and we haven't bought any in ages, what we are being offered is milky, almost like aquamarine, but a little bit sort of um, varied in colour, tanzanite, which wouldn't even be a B grade, for what we were being offered for AAA grade two years ago, genuinely. We are being offered this for this price because, partly because of the rarity of it, scarcity of it, but partly because essentially Tanzanite 1 aren't bringing it out of the ground anymore. So all the artisanal miners are going, right, no competition, we can raise our prices. This is a strand that we have had hidden away in our vault for a while. It is not milky. It is bold, beautiful, and it's round which instantly makes it even more appealing. Now, I do just have to let you know that Tanzanite is of course December's birthstone. Therefore, we have been trying to bring you as much Tanzanite as we can. And I'm so sorry to say that even though I'm well aware we have made a conscious effort within the company to bring you more Tanzanite this month and last month, I am well aware that this is only the second strand of Tanzanite I've brought you in the last two months. This is a scarcity level beyond, above and beyond scarcity levels of stone right now. We have not bought any of this in ages. We didn't buy any when we were in Hong Kong. We didn't buy any uh, earlier on in the year in our travels either. So today what we're bringing to you, I believe should pay attention to the 800% increase and beyond that we've seen in the industry. But we're not going to, because we're us. This strand right now for eight, uh, for sorry, for 40 carats could very, very easily retail for mid triple figures because the fact of the matter is these are not only lovely in their shape which is an unusual shape to see it in but also it's that intensity of color these aren't dilute these aren't poorly saturated they're big they're bold they're strong this is the only strand of tanzanite rounds that we have available for you at this moment in time so if you and, and i don't just mean in a five to six mil i mean full stop in our vaults this is the only tanzanite round we have we have not purchased any in ages, which means that even if, which we wouldn't, by the way, but even if we made a purchase of this today, we could be looking, what's it on Tanzanite at the minute? Oh, I didn't know this before. Is it an eight month with Tanzanite or is it six month? I can't remember. It depends on the, the um, leggage and stuff like that. But yeah. Six months, let's say, to hedge our bets. It could be six months until you actually see that strand we ordered come to screen. It is a rarity, it is a scarcity, it is difficult and expensive to source right now. Mid triple figures on this easily. But today, 
hundred and one ninety five. That genuinely, without a shadow of a doubt, for the quality and the luxury you're getting here is phenomenal. Let's remember that we know full well that that mine has closed. We are well aware that that mine may stay closed for one more week or one more year or one more decade. Literally, there is no ending to that mine enclosure. It's a government closure. We do not know that closing date. The fact of the matter is that right here, right now, we are being offered milky qualities, completely opaque qualities, not bright and bold and open like this one, for what we were paying on pretty much triple A grade qualities, you know, two to five years ago. This is something very, very, very special indeed. This is your chance, your opportunity. And if you're thinking, but Bex, I really want to give this to, you know, December birthstone it's at the end of the month. Will I get it in time? Yes, absolutely. You'll get it before the new year if you get that express delivery. Wow. Do not for a second think that this is worth 40 pounds because at the prices or the prices that we are being offered at the moment we would not be able to buy this back at 40 pounds and that is no exaggeration we are at the moment on good deals and we are being very very happy at around about the nine um dollars per carrot actually though i've just brought it for you at a quid a carrot and that is only 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 because and that is literally only because we got it before Tanzanite One closed, before that the market went, ah, quick, scrabble, um, and before essentially um, we had, you know, blown all the competition out of the market and therefore you want Tanzanite, you better be prepared to pay because the biggest, you know, sort of organization to bring them to you is, is, is done for now. That is an incredible deal, isn't it? Absolutely. I mean, really. Amazing deal. Mm. I don't think I've ever seen rounds at that quality at that price before. That's no. amazing. No, no, no. no. And that is the fact of the matter yeah. is that I want to let you know I've got um, uh, less than 15 available now. Um, you know, at that price point with £61 off, not 61%, £61 pounds off, what you're dealing with here is genuinely something that I'm not even entirely sure we'd be able to buy for £61. Pounds for this kind of level and quality. In fact, um, a while ago now, I did a Facebook Live with um, the lovely Marie, our um, then, you know, our wonderful um, head of buy-in. And um, she talked about how she was being offered Tanzanite that almost looked like aquamarine. Yeah. Mm. Which is, is nowhere near that. It's mm. absolutely amazing. No way at all. It's incredible, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely incredible. Even if you don't know what you're going to do with that now, that is just one not to miss. No, really not to absolutely miss. Absolutely not to miss. A must-have opportunity. It's just incredible. 40, ca 40 carats for £40. Pound, pound each. Right. That is just astonishing. And when you're looking at this too, with that transparency, it's the display of colour it yeah, gives. Yeah, the colour's just phenomenal, isn't it? It it's really is. absolutely amazing. It's so even throughout the yeah. strand, which is tricky to do. It really is tricky to do. Oh, I've literally got about 5% um, of me stock left, would you say? About 5% stock left, 5% left. This is an incredible strand that could go a very long way as well. Oh, yeah, I, I would be using it sparingly. I mean, I am one that often sort of says, oh, yeah, just use the whole strand. But this, this is, this is just something else. This is, this is use one, maybe use three in a piece. Absolutely amazing. And you know what? These are way large enough. If I just pop that as a ring, that is the smallest one on the strand. Just oh, you can't you can't imagine that that would be three pounds just for those three. Mm -hmm. That's just that's just crazy. Yeah, absolutely incredible. Forty pounds for forty carrots. That's a pound a pop. And I have just been handed Oh look at that colour together. The wow. This has got a really big graduation on it. How would you pair these in together? Because I think when you have got the luxury of having such ideal matching almost qualities in colour, yeah. then they deserve to be together. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, I would probably be using them with pearls and maybe alternating them. But I would be using the this kind of uh, 
the flat oval mm. around the neckline where it's actually going to sit against the, against mm. the skin really nicely. I think that would look mm. absolutely amazing. But equally, just maybe one round and then one of the larger ovals at each side in a slider bracelet, just some three pieces that would just complement each other beautifully. I've literally got single figures on this one, just to oh. let you know, single figures only. I'm going to bring to you a, uh, this is a more, I would say, traditional shape that we've got here. Yeah. Your carrot weight in each of these is more than likely going to be slightly lesser than the big individual carrots on the rounds and therefore kind of price per strand, we are able to make it uh, very affordable. Your price point today should be deal. We are rolling it down for you today though. And if you got both strands, you'd get them for, is that right? Wow. Wow, both strands for 75 pounds should be 204, 204 about. Wow, that's a lot of tanzanite. That is a lot of tanzanite. And let's remember, a lot of good quality good tanzanite. Quality matching, colorized yeah. tanzanite. That's amazing. That's wow. That is something special, wow, isn't wow, it? Wow. And this is a lengthy, lengthy strand. It um, is actually really for tanzanite to have a strand of that length is amazing. Isn't agree it? with you. As a really long strand for it. The graduation on this is quite fast. It's a six by four to an eight by five. Why is that good? It just, it just gives you more flexibility in, in the way that you can use it. So you can have a real statement piece by using some of those in the center. You can have some really delicate, just really delicate drop earrings. It's, it just gives you far more flexibility in, in the way that you can use it without throughout lots and lots of pieces of jewelry. Mm. I just think that looks so enticing and exciting. Do you remember those, um, those silver stud earrings that we had earlier? Can you imagine just one of these Tanzanites drops? That round yeah, hammer Yeah, the round hammer yeah. disc, yes. Yeah, that, with that little loop. Stunning. And you would literally need yes, one. Yes, just one. And that's going to reflect beautifully. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. 30 for 95, good work. Let me now bring to you... <gasps> wow. This is a luxury. This is high-end luxury. 15 exactly I've got. And the final price is under 30 pounds. Wow. There you go, under 30 pounds. That's got amazing sparkle. The sparkle and sheen on this, not only on the luster, sort of the outer light interaction, but also that glow of brilliance yes. internally. What we've got on here are some of the rarer colours of your sapphire. I know what you're thinking if you are new. I ain't gone. Sapphire just comes in blue, doesn't it? No, not at all. It's just that sapphire is one of the more common colours. So that's why you see it more on the high street because it's one of the easiest colour to get. Um, I have got for you on here lavender um, sapphires maybe, um, pink sapphires on here. I've got clear mm -hmm. as well. Now ice white sapphires are tricky to be able to get your hands on because normally they're snapped up um, to um, sort of bring into play a variant of, of diamond. Uh, yeah, I've got some really powerful hues in this, haven't I? Absolutely beautiful. Something like this is high-end quality. How would you promote the beauty of this to someone who doesn't know that sapphire comes in any other colour? Oh, I don't, I'd have to tell, tell them, obviously, about where it's come from and, and everything. But I think I would be tempted to, because we've got that, that nice... I know we've got a very... Is it, is it graduated? It looks like there's a very, very slight mm. one just, just on those ends there. Mm. But I would be tempted to just put one of each colour together because it's so uniform. And just really, so it literally tells the story of all the different colours going through. Just this little section Beautiful. into a slider bracelet. Maybe with that five metres of 0 0.4 Ooh, stone yes. over wire I did before. Yes. yes. Oh, it's absolutely beautiful. Really is special, isn't it? It is for all of you magpies out there, those of you who love the decadence, the beauty, the aspiration that is owning a sapphire. No, not just owning working with sapphire and then owning or gifting or selling 49.95 pence this is definitely one to get your authenticity as well just so that you can prove definitely. it is sapphire because a lot of people out there like you say don't believe that it comes in any different colors totally because yeah. because we're so swamped with blue sapphire yes. in the market 49.95 i hear you say shoulda woulda coulda i said under 30 didn't i and I meant it. 
1995 today. We are getting you ready. Luxury for less. This weekend is all about saving, saving, saving. We are going to be saving you so much money this weekend. We really, truly are. We are bringing you your pre-Christmas save-a-thon. Oh yeah. Some of the items that we've got on over this weekend is baffling. Absolutely mind-boggling. On Sunday, we've got the mid-show, we've got 12 deals of Christmas, which is going to make you smile from ear to ear. You've seen some examples of some of the goodies that we've got for you in that little VT um, that we did. Um, it's spectacular. It's your last turn in silver and stuff this year that we're guaranteeing and last certain collections of gemstones and amongst others. Tomorrow, we have got the start of that pre-Christmas clearance, if you will. And we are going to be bringing to you so many gems. Um, dog tooth amethyst is coming up pretty much straight away um, in, in the eight o'clock, um, 8 a.m. hour. And then I know full well that um, on the mid-show, what was it? I did write it down. Oh yeah, we've also got book club a bit on the morning. I love Ooh. a little book club. Loads of books and loads of things. And some of them I've not even seen before. So that's really cool too. Um, what else do I have? Oh yeah, I've got a seven strand mega bundle tomorrow. Ooh. And the price on it is like loop de loop. If I say to you, like we're going, I know it's clearance. I know I'm saying all these high end things. It shouldn't really be clearance, but hey, that's what we're doing. Um, let me bring, whilst we're here, and don't forget if you're watching on the repeat and you want to treat yourself to these sort of, let's say a mousse bouche items for your clearance, then it's all still on your, uh, Posting and packaging, that's the one, isn't it? Look at, oh, look that. at those. Connectors like this with that wonderfully smooth sort of rub over yeah. design is so expensive looking. Just that in a ring, easy peasy. Yeah. What do you look for when you're looking at Labradorite in designs like this? Do you know what I would do with these? Go on. Do you remember the Spadal strand that we had earlier? double-sided oh uh, yeah yeah i would very drop facets. one from the bottom i have a pendant and earring so we're using all three and then you've got double-sided because you've got the labradorite on both sides as well and the different look with the earrings and then the, yeah that's yeah. what i would do that's brilliant isn't it i have got for you 95 solid sterling silver i love that yeah really easily into a ring really really simple just some sterling silver wire and just a little loop at each side yeah, I just love the beauty of that. Let me just show you some of this to just prove. Hang on, hang on. Just prove I'm not just saying, just showing you the good in. Look at that. More of your sort of baby blues in this. Yeah. And lovely golden hues too. Absolutely gorgeous. I love the way it mixes the facets. Yes. That's really lovely, isn't it? Would you use all three together, and if so, how? Oh, if I was, I'd probably use all three together in a bracelet, just linked together in a bracelet. It's really simple with a jump ring and then just onto a slider bracelet. I think that would look really nice, but I would be tempted to use them individually, like, as in earrings and the pendant. Yeah. yeah. I love that idea so much. I'll bring you the other one as well. Hang on, two ticks. Here's your other. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. It's amazing. They're just such good quality. Oh, they're just show-offs, aren't they? Yeah. And the fact is that the light really moves all the yeah. way through too, so we can see it here in yeah. the studio. That, that the quality of that Labrador is, is excellent, isn't it? All three, one price, but that's not it. Twelve ninety five. We're about to go down to. Just pick up the phone and seize the moment. As we say, this is kind of your warm up for, let's say, right. to our Ooh, fabulous to weekend. Tomorrow. Oh my goodness, it is. Mind-boggling. £12.95. pence. I adore that so, so, so much. If I could pair it with, because I'm thinking size-wise it's nice, how would you do a design with those two? Uh, you could just link straight on with uh, your beading thread and a crimp and a crimp, crimp cover. Yeah, just and, and just make that, that bracelet maybe connection. 
That's a nice size yeah. for a bracelet, isn't yeah. it? And let's just say I were to do that, let's say I were to make a bracelet, how much are these working out each? Is it about four pound? Four pound yeah. thirty two says the brain box carry. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. About. And then let's say we're gonna use, you probably can use about half of that strand. Half a strand yeah, probably of not this. Even that, but yeah. No. But that was um it was two ninety five. So that is let's say one pound fifty worth of gemstones. Mm. I've made let's say three pound, four pounds seventy ish, four pounds eighty ish. Wow for a genuine gemstone yeah. and sterling silver bracelet. Yes. Obviously you have to add your clasps and stuff, yeah, but nonetheless. Class. Yeah, it's only gonna be a couple of pounds really for, you, for the rest of your findings. Mm. But I mean, between 20 and 30 pounds for that bracelet, easily. Oh, yeah. easily. Yeah. Especially as the stones that people know. Yes. And they're a phenomenal one at that. Let me do a quick recap of if I may, on this rose quartz. It was baffling us earlier on that we were able to bring to you such okay. caliber at such a low price. Yeah. Look at that sparkle. For anyone who has just tuned in, we were talking a lot about the skill and the craftsmanship of this. We also spoke a little bit about makes. What would you be making with this if I said to you, use the whole strand? Um, I have found out lately that we can fit our 0 0.5 elastic through the micro faceted strands. So you could actually make a, stress, a stretchy bracelet. Eee! Really nice, simple, easy make. I mean, that is going to be something really special with these because you get to see it yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, and also if you were to, if you were to use the elastic, you could make a little ring, a little elastic elastic Darn. ring. Maybe finish it off with a, a sterling silver crimp cover, mm. and then you maybe have that crimp. So you'd actually have like the sterling silver sort of a little bead at the front, and then the band would be all this. That'd be lovely. Yeah, really Almost like a it. sort of reverse half a turn, yeah. in a way. That's quite a nice idea, that, actually. I love the sparkle. I love the shine. I love that it's natural. And I love that it's £2.95. That's literally not even a... It's not even a cup of coffee. No, it's not. Most plate, yeah. No, it's not. It's not yeah. even a frothy coffee. Yeah. Do you know what? When I was at Glastonbury Festival, the year just gone, um, a because they went completely plastic free, which is obviously very admirable, etc. Um, but you couldn't buy any plastic bottles or anything. Yeah. So if you wanted water, you had to buy a can of water, so mm -hmm. seventy centiliter or whatever it is, and they were two pound fifty. Yeah, still water. I bought a a soft drink mm -hmm. in a very very posh hotel a couple of weeks ago, and that was mm. four pound fifty. Four pound fifty. Yeah. Made the money. <laughs> this though is not um, you know as as still and bland let's say as a, as, a, as you still water it's got a little bit of fizz and sparkle to it and it's definitely going to last longer than not only the water but also your four pound fizzy pop yes. two pounds 95 today i love that quality i adore that beauty don't forget as well i did oh, that kit yeah. earlier we just popped on. in between there so you've got that did that this kit. larger facet sparkle and then that little twinkle in between yeah delicacy yeah. bit of a quick whack of yes. color as well if you did want that um it was the candy floss collection um if you did want the uh this as a kit it was all of those there you go oh get back here sliders there you go they work well they work, don't they? That's just beautiful, that, isn't it? Gorgeous. So they are going to go alongside it if you do want that collection. Let me bring January's birthstone. Let me bring to you garnet. This is a very deep and intense garnet. Very oh, berry. Nice. Very, very berry. Type of strands that if you wanted to make that into a stretchy bracelet, Ladies and gents of many ages oh, yeah, would grab definite, it. Definitely on the, on the, yeah, definitely unisex. We are bringing to you here a 80 carat strand of your garnet. We've only got a couple of them, literally just a handful or two. So we're going to bring to you price straight on in. It is totally natural. It is January's birthstone and it is just six pounds and 95 pence for wow. you today. Tell me where, sorry. Ooh. Opal with Chalcedony now. Have a look at these. It's a real bit of majesty and uniqueness that these form together, actually. 
We haven't sort of, you know, Frankenstein's monstered these together, you know, got one of another and gone, let's glue them together as you might see in a doublet or a triplet. This is naturally forming. Naturally occurred. It's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. It really is yeah. sensational, it's, isn't it? It's still got that, that kind of ethereal look to it, hasn't it? Definitely. What we've got, it has got a touch of the boulder opal about it. You're not wrong, yeah. Danny. What we have got for you today is we have essentially opal where it's forming in the crust of the earth in Australia. It's a very long time to form and Chalcedony basically gets on in on the action when it has a chance. Two very distinctive different gemstones, very sizable drill holes for your workability and today very affordable. £12.95 pence today. Thank you so much You're for welcome. joining us. When are you on next? I'm back on the 30th on the mid show. Eee, fabulous. Looking forward to yeah. it. Have an incredible break <gasps> over too, Christmas. Um, do enjoy it. I know you're pretty organised, yeah. aren't you? Pretty much done. Uh, Katie, thank you so much. Thank you so much for tuning in tonight. Let's remind you tomorrow is a big, big day. Saturday and Sunday, Clearance Central. We are going to be bringing to you things such as your dog tooth amethyst, your book club, as well as the wonderful Deb Rudge. So do not go anywhere. So much more to come. Sleep well. JM gave to me silver chain bundles, triple finding steels, double mystery pendant, triple cap collection, double connector bundles, silver mystery charms, triple bead deals, one fed of blues. Trio mystery wires, lots of threading packs, mystery gemstones, and a parcel of luxury gems.